<laughs> live. Happy Friday. Again. 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 Uh, yes. Uh, tonight, we are going to improve my mental health by not taking off Flex Seal. Tonight, we I picked up a new kit. Uh, I talked about this on the news a couple weeks ago, but it's from Hobby Plus, and it's a CR18 Builder's Edition. So it's, it says 18th scale, but it's it's kind of just like a long wheelbase 24th scale. Um, but the nice thing about this kit is that, while it is a kit, it also has all the electronics, everything in it. So the 24 scale or 18 scale, it's like, eh, kind of sucks to have to buy an expensive motor and bat, all that stuff, but this has everything. So, hmm. there yeah. you go. Check in, everybody. See where we're from. And, yeah, I also think that this will be, it should be a quicker kit. Obviously, well, obviously quicker than a Flex Seal truck. Yeah. I also spent basically all of Saturday getting that cleaned up. Yeah, you did. All right. But it made a miraculous recovery. Hello, everyone. Our cats are screaming. Yes, they are. Look at the little body. It's like a mini VS410 body. That's cute. It is. Um, greetings from Estonia. Oh, this one is hard. <laughs> it just says hard. Okay. Okay. Um, oh, look at that. The transmission comes assembled with the motor on it. Oh. You're just. Oh, the, yeah. I guess you, my hand is in the picture. Somebody said, Have you been in the cat fight with the cat? Well, uh, Chief is a new baby, so. Yeah. Uh, so, actually, he, yeah. We're just yeah. getting him to not play with our hands anymore. All right. Ron Sterner gave us $10. Thank you, Collins, hey, uh, Iowa. Here. Ooh, where is Collins, Iowa? I'd be interested to know. The front axle comes. This comes more assembled than I would have thought. Uh, um, ben, yeah. in the Yeti, it is... Iced coffee. Iced coffee. Iced coffee is all. Uh, wow, this may be the fastest kit ever built. Yes. Nicole, the chassis is basically assembled with the shocks. Audio sound a bit low rent in the main camera angle. Mm. Oh, Thanks, that's Alex. interesting. Um, let me double. Oh, yeah. Hi. It's your little brother. Hang okay. On. That should fix our audio. Thank you. Thank you for telling us. Chibi. And so, yes, should have that. Suki, seriously. Oh, she's staring in a pile of screws. Wait, what do you have in your mouth? What are you eating? <gasps> Why are you wet? What are you eating? This could be the world's quickest build. Yes. And then we'll just sit here and ask Nicole questions. We have Brian Sherwood. What's Good up? Good evening from North Carolina. But is that Brian Sherwood's in? Huh. I thought Brian, I thought Brian, I thought you were in Pennsylvania. No. Or not Pennsylvania. Or up. Northeast. Oh, northeast, yeah. So this kit isn't like the normal Hobby Plus. It's supposed to come with upgrades in the box. We shall see. Maybe we have to disassemble everything before we can assemble it. So it's like a regular kit, but it takes twice as long. There he is. What? Nicole had a tough day today, so she requested purple lights. I did. Nicole is on a jury right now for a month. I am on a jury for a month. Of course, she can't talk about it. I cannot. Right? No, cannot talk about it. But you can make wild guesses, though. But it's a lot. Um, all right. Sweden, we have New York. You think you want to try that? You think he's oh God, drinking coffee. <laughs> We're lagging. Mm -hmm. It's Chief's fault. Come on back. Come on. Sweet. There we go. Okay. Okay. 
hopefully that fixes some stuff. Sorry about that. Try to turn it off and back on again. That's what I always do. Yeah, it seems to work. Yeah. It's a good start at least. Yeah. Um, I think that um, <laughs> Eddie would have a fucking conniption if I was on the it's a uh, grand jury for six months. Man, uh, the instructions on this, uh, not super in depth. Look, look at this. There's a uh, bag A, bag B, bag C, bag D. Like <laughs> this truck, the instructions are three pages. <laughs> ah. All right, we may have to come up. This is what I get for not opening the box. <laughs> I tell you that. I like to not open the box. I like people to experience it with me. I thought you didn't like box opening things. Well, I'm not like making a whole video about opening a box. That's what people do. They just read the outside of the box and then they open it and they're like, here's what's inside. And then the end. That's what you say. The end. It's the dumbest thing ever. Anyone hitting up Dead Man's Crawl in the morning? Ah. You have plenty of time to paint. Oh, true. That is true. I, I'll make Nicole uh, do commentary while I go shoot paint on it. I don't want to do that. Hey, you don't want coffee. Well, isn't this just a cute little chat? Scott Norton. Anything? There's, there's Scott. Scott from Connecticut. <laughs> yes, something did come in the mail today. I know, and it's like killing me, and I don't even care what it. I mean, obviously, it's not for me, but I like, like, it says not to open it till Wednesday, and so I. She's like, I. What? I just want to open it, <laughs> like, and I'm like, no, I'm gonna wait till Wednesday. <laughs> <ugh>. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a cute little chassis that's assembled with the aluminum upgraded shocks on it. Battery tray in the rear there with the rubber band mounts. So this is a kit, quote unquote, but there's some significant steps of the kit already completed. Matt Connolly, I think it was Josh's that fought with pool noodles. Excuse me? In, uh, in Nebraska. Or oh, was that was in Colorado. No, it was Nebraska. What? When what? This says Kyle's did, but there were Josh's that fought. And remember I sent you the article in the middle of Nebraska? Oh, yeah. That was a yeah, Battle of the Josh's. Yes. Um, so. Did... I don't have the mouse, so. Here. Oh, I hit the button. That was my fault. My, my bad. <laughs> See? Can we be done? Nope. Nope. <laughs> so let's. Elephant Rock yesterday? Where's that? Ooh, St. Louis. Oh, fun. Cool spot. Ryan Davis went there. Yeah, that is a cool spot. It's been uh it's been a lot of years since I've been to Elephant Rock. Did I get my gift from Josh? I have not. Nope. Has not. It is being, I had a video conference call about it yesterday though. Are you going to the 11 Operation Charlie for Vets in Diablo, California on May 29th? Hosted by JJ Customs. Um. I feel like we have something that we can. Why do I too? We shall see. It's a possibility, but I. Our Cannot remember. Croc friend work Ponce is here. Rourke. Should have shut up to selection with the shorts, high tops, shoes, and a tuxedo t shirt. Just sele oh, Jerry, yeah. <laughs> Jerry selection. <laughs> is this mouse or. Oh, shit. See, I don't even know how you do that one. I quit. You can see it over here, though. 
Brian Sherwood gave us five dollars. Thank you. Brought it's... to you by the new Ripper too. What's up? Oh God, Brian. It's... Is that mouse a razor basilisk? And yes, it is. Mods know what Nicole's gift is. What? They do know. How much is this kit? This kit, hundred and thirty nine bucks. Let's... How mad are you? You didn't get an orange TRX4 Bronco. <laughs> Isn't it orange? No, that was red. It's clear. Oh, it's red. Yeah, they make an orange one and a red one. I got the red one. This is bullshit. Okay. What they make, now, like I said, this could be one of the fastest kits ever. Or, after now looking at the instructions, maybe not. Because the instructions are pretty poor. No, he didn't tell. I don't think you told Traxxas to send you one. They just. No, we didn't even know. They, yeah. It literally showed up in the mail. And I was just like, I don't know what this box is. But it says from Traxxas. That's odd. And then, boom. No, we were all as surprised as everybody else. Squint Paladoris gave us $5 saying, so, oh my god, hey. Oh my god, hey. Wow. This is interesting because none of the... It's the same money as the Betty, about how much the Betty is. It's about, that is true, yeah. So, we'll see. Now, this does come with some upgrades. It, like I said, it comes with the aluminum shocks. It comes with brass weights for inside of the front wheels. Um... I don't remember if that was all or not. We're we're about to find out. But seriously, this these instructions are lacking. This is a this is an L. Can you show off your Reliant Robin real quick? Ooh, I, will you grab it right there on the shelf? <laughs> Damn it. We're We're too close together. <laughs> we make this space look much larger than it is. And <laughs> so yes um oh here is God. the reliant rob i saw him lay on the box no that's so key oh he was so i haven't cut down the body post yet we'll do that but this is the cam tech three-wheeler with the reliant regal watch the coffee cup with the Reliant Regal body. These bodies are like a thick styrene, so they're almost like a hard body. Now, as it comes, the windows are solid. Moose Jaw cut out the windows to make it look like that, and then he painted it. He added the little shark fin on top. He added a problem, no problem, with, of course, a European license plate. <laughs> what smells? Um, 30. Mods are rude here on the side. And who is Lloyd, which is one of my favorites. A nice hashtag on the... You're just a little hellcat. Um, and then he, Moose Jaw also like custom built a little styrene interior or cage. And then put in a half driver from a bomber. It's awesome. And... Jeez, that he is the most un. What I thought kittens should be nimble. No. No. They're he's all still, just. Yeah, he's still getting his. You know. He's still getting his what? His coordination. Let's. I do want to know why. I mean, he did an amazing job on this. And did you show off the roof? Rough. He put the phonetic spell. Oh, well, you say roof. Um, yes, evidently I say r roof weird. What do I say? I say rough? Rough. On the rough. Yeah, yeah, roof. And it says mods are rude, but I don't know why. Did someone say that? Did someone <laughs> say our mods are rude? They're not rude. <laughs> I'll fight anyone who says our mods are rude. <laughs> Nicole gets very aggressive towards... My people? Yes. If someone does something to my people... Okay, so I'm trying to dis discern which screws it's telling me to use, and that is not easy. Oh, I am using the new, now that I can finally show it, I can 
use our new uh, Vanquish tool mat, our little uh, parts trays. You can see, ooh, ooh. they're silicone rubber, so they're they're flexible. But all the little compartments, I've had them for months and months and months, and just now able to actually sell them after getting clearance from the consumer product safety. This screwdriver is not going to work. I think I have a slightly larger metal handle. Uh, they're all saying that they are rude, so <laughs> whatever. I give up. <laughs> you got a battle I'm, royale on your hands I'm not, that you're not in for? Yeah, not tonight. <laughs> Dawson boss, he got one yesterday. Did you help nice. Josh find the clipless body clips on the tracks of Bronco? What? Are they clipless body clips? Yes. Yes, they are. It's a thing. It's a thing. <laughs> Who said that? Uh, Adam, Kevin. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ooh, it must be these. Are these the same length as these? Who ordered a hearse body? Uh, Moose Jaw, I think, was talking about it. Oh, that's cool. Nothing, Nicole. Just don't think about it. Well, shit. <laughs> Now I'm gonna think about it. Ah. So thanks for that. What did I say? No, it's nothing you did. It was a joke we were making on Wednesday. Uh -oh. That was less appropriate. Mm. Um. Yeah, her body would be sweet. If you're into that kind of thing. I don't know. And I don't see why not. I don't know how big it is. I think it's. What tools do you use for clipless clip? Uh, just. Were you, you just... talking about Chief? Nope. Oh. That that truck. No, never mm. mind. I thought you were talking how how I was describing to you how they do spay or spays now. Oh. <laughs> Pop. Pop. Nope. I. Uh... We were discussing the method of which you take the body off of the new Bronco. And how I described it, it kind of came out wrong. What are we building tonight? We are building the Hobby Plus CR18 Builders Edition. Scott Oplander gave us $5. Thank you for the last time. Josh and I pronounces rough correctly. That's right. Roof. I want to find a Ghostbusters body for my Fortech. Wasn't that a hearse? Or was it was an ambulance. Old ambulance. Old ambulance. Yeah. I haven't watched Ghostbusters again in a long time. You think it holds up? Yeah. You don't? Absolutely. 100%. That's one of the best movies of all time. Yeah, but when was the last time you watched it? Not that long ago. Really? Yeah, I love that movie. Really? Yeah. Ghostbusters? Okay. <laughs> I mean... I mean, at the I remember I remember it fondly. I just haven't watched it in a long time. I just wonder if it's still entertaining. Yeah. Huh. Just Rock RSD said someone caught their car on fire with hand sanitizer. I saw the headline for that, and it was like, "Woman hoarding gas sets herself in car on fire" or something. And I was just like, "I've I've seen a lot of right. gas of very. I mean, that's like all the internet is the last couple of days is people tran." transporting or filling up very inappropriate containers in vehicles. Like, yeah, I don't know. You guys need to check out Only Fools and Horses, classic Brit comedy, and they drive probably the most famous Reliant. Yes, that is what I've always heard. Um, and I, I've not caught that, but I've heard it uh, referenced. A, ton of times 
Okay. Gotta go run an errand. We'll listen in the ranger. <laughs> are, you, are you threatening me? Now you have to give up the Jeep, trade it in for a station wagon? If it was like an old school station wagon, like... She she's begged for like a Nova too. Oh, or, sorry, I mean, Chevy two. Chevy two wagon. Yes, that's my fave. But like, I do have a station wagon. Those are sweet. Oh, that sucks. That people. That what? People are hoarding gas. Yeah. Are you? Or that people don't have gas. Yeah, I kind of wondered what areas of. Is that the Stig in the Reliant? I mean, yeah. Well, isn't it, it's just a white helmet, though, yeah? That makes it the Stig. Yeah. With the third seat that faces backwards? My neighbors had that, and I just remember sitting, facing backwards, like, staring, you know, at car, and I'm, like, as a child, I remember being like, I feel like this is unsafe. But... And then you were just like, ah, oh, it's fine. As you, like your dad finishes a road beer. <laughs> it was the neighbor's station wagon. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we grew up in a different time. Or at least we in the Midwest. <laughs> like, I don't road, think it. road beer was just a thing. Like not not a bunch of them, but like a road beer. <laughs> as long as it's in a koozie. Well, it to be legal. Right. In case you're in a crash or something. Yeah. You can't see the outside of the can. Right. Whatever the rules. <laughs> <laughs> We're going. I'm about to get a call from my mom real quick. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> We're all ready to bag B, baby. How many are there? What? What's a picture on Reddit of a Tesla with a hit? Rack filled with gas cans and one single fire extinguisher. Yeah, I think Jesse sent that to me. Or he definitely put it in the chat, in our mod chat. Wow. I've always wanted a hot rod wagon called the Shaggin Wagon. Shaggin. What was that one that I saw that I sent you? And it was a minivan, but it was like... Oh, God. What was that called? Swagger Wagon. Swagger Wagon. And it was like... A lady my age with kids in the back, and it was just like it was a minivan on like airbags. Yeah, it was thick. It was so thick. Yeah, in the Sacramento area. Mm -hmm. Yes, if you know who. If you know who drives the drives swagger that, wagon, tell them it's sick. That tastes like watered down coffee. Um. Ice is just water that's frozen. It, it'll actually, it kind of melts a little bit if you don't, don't hit me. That one. Mike Upton says we had a 57 Chevy wagon. It was pink. Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, Chris Sparks just got his parts tray. Nice. Montana has two go cups. <laughs> <laughs> Does that kit have oil filled or friction dampers? Uh, these definitely would appear to be of the friction damper variety. No gas all week here in Western North Carolina. Wow. I'm sitting my 94 Roadmaster wagon. That count? Yep. Yeah. Because that's pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Jesse says, where's our parts tray? Yes. I will send all mods, parts, trays, and mats. Texas does carry out alcohol from restaurants. I think Oklahoma, Oklahoma does, does too. too. Nebraska, even some place, you could get carry out margaritas. Oh, yeah. But it was a styrofoam cup with a margarita mix, and then they, the tequila bottle was taped to the side. Uh, or I think they had a thing where like they put they left the paper on the straw. Yeah. And like, as long, you just like, have to leave the paper on the straw until you get home. Like Right. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. Gotcha. Psh, bag C. Yikes. This is going much too fast. How hard would it be to put Capra axles on a BS410 chassis? Uh, Go look 
at episode one of season two of Flip That Truck. It's not very difficult, but there's some things you got to do. How big of a 4S pack could you fit in the rift? Um, they have battery dimensions, and that's the big thing, because it depends on, like, the the C rating versus the milliamp, like you, not all 5,000 milliamp packs are the same size. So you have to look at the, look at the battery capacity and then just shop for batteries. But force S is way too much on that stock system. Oh man. I keep thinking this is a lighter. That is a flash drive. Yeah. Do you need a lighter? Do you feel like setting something on fire? I don't. Do we need to call for help? No, I don't. <laughs> Guy in says, I can't find anywhere listing dimensions. Um. Hmm. There we go. I don't have an answer for oh. you on that. Unless you check my video, I might have listed it. And there. Let's phase the drive shafts even. Apparently we're being slow. I'm sorry. I am. We're being slow. Like speaking, talking wise, because Matt's like, anybody here see flying cars? <laughs> I I'm <laughs> drained. I am drained. You're mentally drained. I am mentally drained. I. Uh, you had to be an adult all day. All like the last two weeks, yeah. and for another three weeks. I don't like being an adult. Yes. I'm in Louisiana right now. Look, they have to go with the X cups. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see you buy that to build that to Maya Abrams tank kit. They have at RC country. Not a freaking chance. Brought a dust if you must. Aloha. Please have badges made for the flexible truck that say FS410. Oh, that's pretty good. That is good. Moose Jaw was saying he could, he could paint over top of the body, like weather over top of it. Why would you want to? I mean, I don't know. I think it should almost just live as it as it yeah. is. I can't sell it though. No, no, not unless somebody wants it as like a memorabilia, yeah. <laughs> like a collector. I had people being like, "I'd like to buy it so I could give it away for a charity thing." I'm like, "No, no." No, that's a terrible plan. No. Like this should never be given to somebody in that in that <laughs> respect. Yeah. Oh my god, Sookie is being incredibly cute. I know. What's with the tank? I just I've seen tank models before and I just have there's no way. There's so many tiny no. tiny pieces. You can um Those are like month long projects for experienced modelers. It sounds like my literal, like one of the levels of my hell. Yeah, like you know tank tracks, like the tracks on yeah. the yeah, like each one of the little tracks oh, is a piece. Like no, no, no. If somebody sent that in as like a mystery thing, like as a joke, return to sender. Yeah, like no. Anyone see my shop players? The tank will make up for this short ass build. I know. I do have like a half a glass of wine. Which is from whenever the last time we had wine on this show was, like two months ago. Yeah, that probably was the last time I drank anything. I'm it's fine, ducklings. It's fine. The cats both follow her around just like it's ridiculous. It does look like ducks follow. Okay. There we go. This is going to be ridiculously short. We're going to have to mask the body and then maybe paint it. You think that would be possible? I think we could get her to sit through that. What did you do? Did you leave like a thump, like a thimble full? She did. She left a thimble full of 
wine. This is what I left myself. Why would I do that? What is wrong with you? Know. I left myself a shot of wine. You know what old you would do to you for leaving that much wine in a bottle? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Was that enjoyable? No. <laughs> How can you quit? I quit. You know how excited I am to go to a one-year-old, one-year-old twins' birthday party tomorrow. Yeah, I know. You're, you're like, I get to go see people. Well, but like, whew. why is this so bindy? Do you have another? I ordered a black rift. Was wondering if it was coming up, coming with updates. It's hard to say. It's uh, I don't think that's something that anybody can guarantee. It depends on where it came from and where it's at. And the... where's Moose Jaw tonight when we need him? Bring us booze. <laughs> it did not get better. I don't think bottles that would twist on caps get better with age. No. Nah. Nah. Especially when they've been opened. I think that's the whole thing with wine is it still has to be sealed. You're right. <laughs> I don't when they say like let your wine air out, they mean for like a few minutes. <sighs> yeah, let it breathe. And so let let it breathe for a month or so. All right. So you're, you're being with flex seal wine now? Yeah. I have used flex seal okay. at work before. But no. If you if you find yourself with a can of flex Whoops. <laughs> if you find yourself with a can of flex seal near your RC car, Stop and ask yourself, what am I doing? And I've heard the whole bat line the inside of your basher bodies. Whatever. I still wouldn't do that. But that, I guess, isn't as bad because people don't care what those look like anyway. But still. What's the most interesting thing anyone has used Flex Seal on? Well, I did use it on a CNC coolant tank not too long ago with mild success. That, okay. Plastic dip my wheels on my one-to-one -to -one today. I've seen that. What? Oh my God. Ripper 2 Kit gave us $2. I believe that's Brian Sherwood. My new name. I'm guessing that's Brian Sherwood. You know what? Just for Brian, we're just going to we're going to go ahead and do that now. Now that he changed his name, just give me like 6 months. <laughs> what type of CNC? It was on a 1998 Matsura ES uh, ES450 coolant tank. Gravy Matter Fab gave us ten dollars. Thank you. Thanks, sir. So, will rock jocks work well under a VS410 chassis kit, and what links would be required to make it work? Yes, they would drop right under a chassis kit, and they just uses a regular SCX102 link set or stock SCX102 links. Um, the only thing that's different is the Drag link and pan hard, which those are included with the chassis kit. <laughs> Hello, she can't find her booze. We have, I just made the weakest drink ever because all we have is vodka and I'm not a vodka drinker. What is the rest of that? Uh, is that bubbly? Yeah. <laughs> Hypothetically, how much would a VS410 Pro that size cost? 18 scale. Do you have a coaster? Hypothetically, man. Uh, like with machined axles and everything? Yes. 500 bucks? I don't know. Get the... Um, it's actually not bubbly. I can't drink bubbly. Well, it's not bubbly. It's, it's blue or Waterloo's version. 
which has a different type of carbonation that doesn't. BS418, you're right, Ben. So will you be building the new element on the live next build? Um, I, read. I don't know what it is, but being an element, my guess is that it's not a kit. My guess is that it's just a RTR. Um, watched vid build on egress by Tamaya Re Rebuild. Thoughts? I don't know what that means. I don't. Does the Axle Gladiator need different weight shock oil front and rear suggestions on weight? Um, I don't think it needs it. I mean, it's that's it's more of a preference thing and like kind of how you're driving. So no, uh, but if I was if I was building a new set, I'd probably start with like forty weight, fifty weight, somewhere in that range, just to see how it reacted and adjust from there. He said, you know, people would buy that. Buy what? Your five hundred dollar eighteen scale oh. BS four eighteen. Yeah, I just don't think it's our market. It's. I think whatever people will buy should be your market. Well, yeah, but like we only have so much capacity, I so <laughs> if we <laughs> we can start doing all that, and then people will be like mad about. I mean, they're already mad about everything. It doesn't really matter, I guess. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Go oh, for it. Wow. Mike J is drinking sugar-free AW root beer. I mean, gotta love some AW root beer. I don't know that I've ever had sugar-free. Does it make you shit yourself like sugar-free <laughs> gummy no. bears? I mean, we don't know diet. that yet. What's that? Yeah. I um. You know what I like? It's cream soda. Oh my god! If I if I could like drink if I could drink. Pop. We, I, which we call it pop, not soda. Pop or Coke. We, you don't call it Coke. You're crazy. Um. Hi. But I would just, if I could, if I could drink it and I was like, oh my gosh. I would have freaking cream soda all the time. Really? Oh, I, cream soda is the best. What was the stuff you would always have it? Like there was always like a certain couple of restaurants that would have it and it was red strawberry no yeah go chicken go had strawberry pop yeah there was another place that had it and it was like a cream soda oh, or a it was like reds yeah but it is it, it is something it's called reds no yes no yes can't just be called reds big red yeah big red it's called big red yes Root beer and cream soda are not the same thing. Exactly. That is true. I will give you that. Root beer is pretty good. Cream soda. You're mm. a psycho. Like, I don't even know who you are. Cream soda is not that good. It's weird on your hat. It looks like a bug. Oh, there's a bug on your hat. No, kill it. It's a mosquito. Kill it. You see that? Ew, you're gross. It's a bug. I just missed so many comments What's up? um eric baker three dollars thank you so much please build a ripper two kit before vs418 <laughs> okay deal <laughs> deal <laughs> he does have hair oh my gosh does oh he oh my god so Emmett's birthday will party is tomorrow. Yes, we have to. Uh, my nephew's birthday party is tomorrow and I'm super excited. And I mean, we're not going to be there, but we're also going to a one-year-old twins birthday parties here for Brandon and Michelle. Yes, they are. They already put the double-sided tape on the bottom side of the ESC. I want to write them a letter. <laughs> like, thank you so much. <laughs> I love what you do. I love what, yes, I love what you do. <laughs> what time? It's 641. I'm going to paint this thing tonight now. You know that, right? While you sit here and read comments. It's my ass. <laughs> Look at all these freaking connectors. Red and black has got to be the moat. 
Um, something V8 could have been an motor. issue with Vanquish customer service. Yeah, I mean... Sometimes? What What is it? Is it somebody in here or is it saying somebody online? Someone in here. Oh. Yeah. Try again. I mean, we have processes and... What is things. the best Raw Builders kit? Raw Builders kit. Um... I mean, really, there's what well, there's the element, there's the SCX102. Is there another one? Good evening, Gary P. Sue Sherwood said, Yes, Ripper 2, please. We'll keep Brian out of my hair. <laughs> These are the best. <laughs> the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you heard it here, folks. Ripper 2 coming soon. Coming soon. Yes. <laughs> Just done. Just knock that thing out. Phoenix says, okay, how about a VS4 4? Four, four? Four, four. Ooh. What does that mean? Quarter scale. Oh, uh, no. Right? Unless you can ride on it. There's no point in making it that big. Sam. <laughs> Literally what she said. <laughs> there are enough of us here that could help that guy. <laughs> Thank you, David Urban. <laughs> Tonight's drink, though, is screwball, peanut butter whiskey, and Jim Beam apple whiskey. Kind of sounds good. I right? mean, I didn't know there was such a thing as peanut butter whiskey, did you? I didn't eat. I mean, I'm not much of a... Uh, uh, yeah. I don't frequent whiskey... Don't fe frequent the whiskey aisle. Carbon Yo. So I don't. I can't. I can't drink a lot. Of, I can't drink carbonation. So Tamaya's making. Whoa. What? <laughs> what? <gasps> Tamaya. Oh, the Tamaya's making right on. But so Tamaya is not making that. Another company is making that out of the UK and it's and Tamaya has licensed it. Well, same diff. Well, no. It's not. It's like if Ford made a car and put Vanquish a Vanquish name on it. Yeah, like that wouldn't be Vanquish making Genesis. a car. What? Like a Kia. Like if they made it, like what isn't it? what's gen what's a Genesis is a Kia. Well, it's a Hyundai, but I'm saying Hyundai, no. Whatever. It's just like if Ford actually made a Vanquish version or something. Like they're not Ford made it, not Vanquish. You know what I mean? Uh, if you're going to make a VS410 the size of a power wheel for my kid, I'm in. Just take my money. Yes, right. <laughs> take my life. I tried a Coke Frosty with Apple Crown and it was pretty good. When I used to go to Nashville all the time, they used to make fire bushwhackers, ball. which was basically a Wendy's Frosty with Fireball in it. Which sounds delicious. It was so good, but it was so bad. Because so I good. think they also, I think that was, that was also back when you could buy Bacardi 151. They also put that in it. So, I mean... It was dangerous. It was so dangerous. And that was, yeah. It would kill you. I mean, back in the day, nothing would have killed me. Right. <laughs> practice. Yeah. Practice, practice, practice. <laughs> if you make a 1 4 scale, Someone will for sure stuff a child in it at some point. <laughs> <laughs> stuff a child in it. It's just, oh, yeah. You. And then that would be the first time ever you'd want to, like, actually use a radio. Be like, what does this do? <laughs> I could just, I could see exactly how that would transpire. <laughs> Let's stuff a kid in here. Except for I'm incredibly protective of my nephew and like don't let him do anything. And so I wouldn't I would be like, 
<sighs> my mom's like, shut up, he's fine. My mom and then my mom sends me a picture one time and she's like, oh, Emmett's climbing the ladder. Your dad, grandpa's, on, papa's on the roof and Emmett's climbing behind him. And she's like, it's fine. He taught him three, what is it? Three points of contact. Three points of contact. When he was like, well, like two years old, this is like three point contact. <laughs> Like Jesus, people! <laughs> oh my God! I'm gonna try and I'll do that later. How big would the ESC have to be for a power wheel? Um, I mean, honestly, like the ESCs that are in, like that Mamba XLX2, that's probably plenty big because that thing's a, a super high. It just depends on how fast you want to go, really. Um, Dale C, mm -hmm. did you see the steel beam failure on the I-40 bridge outside Memphis? I did not. Oh, you didn't? They said it's going to take like two months to fix and it's like the main bridge in, to Memphis. Yeah. Sounds like a country song, doesn't it? Main bridge to Memphis. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Memphis. That's going to be for real now. Um, <sighs> somebody else is, is what, what's with the Pokemon? Why are some, it's a huge thing right now. But, and then there was a fight and okay. Like, somebody's not selling it because of, yeah. Uh, target took it out of their stores because like for safety. three grown men beat tried to beat up another grown, but these are like between 20 and 35 year olds. What? Sh this is not the what? same. People don't get in a fight over this. What? Not to try and buy them. I'm just saying. Oh, wow. Don't get so snarky. A hole. Anyway, so yes, they are. They pulled them out of their stores so that uh, people wouldn't fight. But they tried, these three guys tried to like fight this other guy. The other guy had a legitimate concealed carry. He didn't shoot anybody. But uh, he sh drew and they ran away. Mission accomplished. Oh. Striker 2, I'm just now seeing your comment, but I did not see anything before. We have somebody named you, Rowdy Yates. Okay. That is a DJ, a name of a DJ on like a, a country. You think he's going to steal, steal your Memphis idea? Um, no. <laughs> but... I'm just saying that. I'm guessing. If it was the same rowdy, which I, I'm assuming it's not because this man looks young and rowdy or is older, but maybe it's not. Um, the wrench from Memphis makes my cousin's work commute go from 25 minutes to an hour and 45 minutes one way. Ooh. Dale C says, I grew up in the heyday of Pokemon. That shit is like crack to me. I'd throw some punches over new Pokemon. <laughs> That's hilarious. I think I, the Midwest will fight over anything. I mean, I mean, I don't know where the fight happened, but mostly the reason for no fights in the RC field is that it's online. If they were in person, it would become Black Friday at Wally World. <laughs> yeah. what the is big, that? What the is VS410 axles are on. The what is that? The, come here. Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> that was part of the joke from the, the oh. Traxxas body. Yeah, man. What? I would, yeah, I don't watch <laughs> you and Matt. I'm sorry. I don't. <laughs> like, I, uh, so, yeah. <laughs> did see it. I assume that these are going to have to be trimmed down to some point. So I'm not going to, I put the body or the, 
it, that's like body posts, basically. I had to put on the two bumpers. You can upgrade a power wheel battery? Sure. You can upgrade anything. Why have you not upgraded your nephews? My gatekeeper is making a clicking sound in the front axle. What's causing it and what could be a solution? I need help, Josh. Uh, Enduros have bad gears. Like the, the gear design on Enduro axles is just not very good. It's very tiny. Um, so you likely started to damage the gear set in there. So you need to either replace that. But at the same time, I would advise you to either replace the bearings as well, or even better, replace the plastic housing, the bearings and the gears like to be safe. Because if the housing has started to fatigue and move, then it'll start letting the gears separate and you'll get that clicking. So sometimes you can replace those gears and bearings and the housing will still be weak, and then you'll blow up the next set of gears five times faster. So, unfortunate, but that is my recommendation. Frank Slugga, sick RC, says I bought an ultimate slash off a guy that needed mon money for Pokemon cards. Dang. That's like... Hard up for some Pokemon. <laughs> that's like buying something that has flex sealed axles off a guy. Than he had sold today. That I mean, you, you're saying he's he made a wise choice. He's a savvy businessman. I'm not gonna sell it. There's no way I can sell it. I can't sell it to anybody. <laughs> That's not how I sound. It was worth it. Don't worry, I have an idea to put even more into it. Hello from Nash Vegas. It's Dre from Blacksmith RC. Hey, hey, hey. I'm now trading Pokemon for a Ripper. <laughs> Nicole, there are kits you can buy to upgrade a Hot Wheels, brushless, high volt motors, and all. You really want your nephew going 35 miles into a trade the front. Fall I mean, I mean, she's here to party. No, but if he can go faster, like, he would love to go faster. Everyone says you do sound like that. <laughs> <laughs> Be honest. Do you think the new Bronco is good? I'm going to the hobby store tomorrow with a pocket full of cash. Um, I mean, it's a TRX4 underneath in the end. So if you like the body style, then yes. Because the TRX4 is a good platform. It's durable. It's not the most capable thing in the world because of, you know things it's just it's a little top heavy you know in comparison but you can do lots of things to a trx4 to make them fairly capable so that shouldn't scare you off um so if you like the body yes. if you like the body get it the body sit the body mounting system is fantastic do you want to know the joke about why we were why no. you don't no it made that easy okay pretty sure i assembled that one. it's not a flex seal truck but it's okay ish look at the cuteness that's happening behind you right now that's pretty that's pretty cute yeah we'll give you that how did i do this wrong <laughs> i'm pretty sure i did this like the directions said i doubt that very seriously is it available right now the right. Um, bronco uh i don't know that i don't i didn't think so yet Other things you can buy with TRX for money. A lot of tacos. One Pokemon card. A million White Castle burgers. <laughs> RC fun and cool stuff. You have a great weekend as well. Oh, my little baby is so tired. Come here. Uh, Pre-order for Bronco. Oh, are you mad? Yeah. You're mad. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Get out of his eyes. No. Has Josh told you about the most amazing idea for the Flex Seal VS410? I'm super excited. Oh. This is Dale. Uh, so Dale came up with this idea. Watch the coffee. Um, you know how the Flex Seal commercials, they had, oh, this, so they had the boat yeah. and all that? Yeah. Um, so Dale suggested, hey, why don't you turn it into a boat car? Like a duck boat? Well, kind of, yeah. Like, throw some outboard motors on the back and try and make it float and drive across the water. Right. So, I mean, you may as well. I, I kind of thought it was a pretty good idea as well. Now, 
turns out RC outboard motors, not super cheap. Then you're not going to do that. But in the name of the flex seal you truck. You can eat shit. I'm just saying. If you, I swear to Christ, if you. It. I mean. If you spend another I mean, dollar on that <laughs> truck that I can't ever sell. <laughs> I think once you put outboard motors on it, then it's like no, 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 no. And you may... already drilled, you already grinded off all the flex seal anyway. It's not going to float. It's still a flex seal. Truck. Oh, cool! It's going to be an anchor. Oh, you, wait, an, wait, 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 an wait, wait, Anchor with an outboard motor. Neat. Wait, you thought Neato. the actual flex seal on there is what made it float? No, I did not think that. So why did you think by me taking I'm the flex seal that, off? I'm just saying that that's, that that's not a thing anymore. It, it's it's still a flex seal truck. But there's no flex seal on it. Yeah, but it's the, that's the thing. And no, I did not. Did you really think that I was I just that? one. I was like, really? did you think it had some sort of special buoyancy? <clears throat> I'm just saying, like. Like, that's always going to be the flex seal. Truck. Sippy's really going to pay attention to you. I know. <laughs> Hit the like button for the flex boat. <laughs> flex boat. The only problem yeah, is... You is should that... have boat trucked it before you fixed it. <laughs> <laughs> the only problem is you should see how long the shipping time is on getting outboard motors. One didn't seem like enough. I thought that three was a better idea, but after seeing the prices, I was like, maybe two. This is my favorite TV show. Have you? I've seen Top Gear, yes, but Top Gear has millions of dollars given to them by the BBC. Like, not like we don't have the backer like the BBC. So, I mean, maybe after Flex Boat, maybe they pick us up. Doubt it. <laughs> I like, doubt it. Hey, Josh, we see, we saw what you did with flex seal boat truck. We <laughs> boat truck. <laughs> would you, would you be interested in starting the new no. USA branch? Of <laughs> That's already done. Been done. <laughs> Top Gear USA. Maybe I get it in. <laughs> it's been done. Oh my God! You're so you just wait stupid. until you see how fast I make a VS410 go with two brushless outboard motor. <sighs> yeah, tell Vanquish to front the money. I'm gonna call Steve uh, right now. Yeah, she's gonna tell. Yeah, she's gonna go ahead and do that. Say, hey, Steve, uh, listen to Josh's dumb fucking idea. <laughs> <laughs> and he's gonna be like, uh, no. <laughs> like, uh, you're an idiot. He'll say the same thing. Uh, yeah. Steve and, I, Steve and a team. <laughs> Rob Montana gave us $5. Thank you. Sending you $5. Doja from the moon. Doja <laughs> fans know what's up. You guys are in a good mood tonight. Beautiful night in Montana. Oh, love it. Josh has Thank backers Rob. a few dollars at a time. <laughs> Let me tell you. We only need a couple hundred of you guys <laughs> to take care of these motors. You're a fucking idiot. Did you seriously, are you seriously spending hundreds of dollars? <laughs> <laughs> Do you already ordered them? I'm. Uh... <laughs> oh my God. You're so stupid. You're so stupid. You're such an idiot. Uh, Dale C, we're coming up your way next weekend. I'll see you in Seattle. Like, <laughs> yeah, remember Dale's <laughs> Dale's idea. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so stupid. It's a the, I mean, oh my god, that truck is going to be infamous. Completely stupid. It's gonna be a thousand dollar anchor <laughs> yep so dumb. <laughs> uh. 
<laughs> you just wait to see how much spray foam it takes. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. The Carolina ghost gave us five dollars. Thank you. I'm cracking up because Josh is laughing his butt off. Josh is an idiot. Like... <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's gonna be so good. Just tie it to a fishing pole. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Just I was gonna get caught up in my boat motors and then Wrap up in them, stop them, cut the line, and sink. <laughs> they you look know like what would happen if that happened. I would make your stupid ass walk out in that <laughs> cold ass water and go fish for it. Worth it. Like you better put a big old magnet underneath so you can have a big old magnet on top to fish it out of the water. That's sound logic. <laughs> Uh, I mean, <laughs> I've had worse ideas. <laughs> and then, Your Honor, I killed him. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ron Starner. Gave us five dollars for the red green flex boat fund. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Just put a bobber on the line by the motors. <laughs> Josh, have you ever dabbled in boats? The only time that we've dabbled in boats is when we put a half stick of dynamite in one in Oklahoma and blew it up. That's the only time we've dabbled in boats. Right? I think so. Yeah. Dave S. Hey, gave us $5. Thank you. Just because Josh seriously needs some help tonight. Love <laughs> the look on your face, Nicole. Oh my God. <laughs> Not telling. Wants to know when they're scheduled to be delivered. Um, <laughs> anytime from like June twenty second to July twenty fourth, like <laughs> like a while. What else did you do in Oklahoma? I think we blew some other shit up. We that blew time. lots of stuff up, yeah. actually. Yeah, it was a good time. There was a lot. There was a lot of dynamite. I, a surprising amount of dynamite, even for Oklahoma. Was it mm, that year? What? I mean, there was because, always dynamite. Because, um, what's his name? Was it? Yeah, we shouldn't incriminate anybody, and specifically by name. Wow. <laughs> but yeah, he brought a lot of dynamite that Phil. year. Yeah. Phil, yeah. Every time something would blow up, everyone would, God damn it, Philip. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> uh, Brandon Garrett gave us $5. Thank you. New drinking game. One drink each time Nicole calls Josh an idiot or dumb or stupid. One shot for each item. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Matthew Jorgensen gave us two dollars. Thank you to buy some ice for the beating. Um, Dale C gave us five dollars. Sorry, Nicole, you can punch him now. We are listing our house next weekend, so I can't be home. Hit me up if you're actually coming. I'll be in downtown. We where are we going? Washington. Well, we're well, no, no, no. I mean, no, the actual city. Oh, Arlington. I don't know. Flying into Seattle. We're flying into Seattle, and then we're going to Arlington. Roddy Yates gave us $5. Thank you. Thank you, guys. $5 from a call calling an idiot like three times in a single sentence. <laughs> that, that's shock mainly setting in. Yeah, because you are an idiot. Um, <laughs> Vlad R Ridge R says, from the question I asked earlier, are there any available axle upgrades for the gatekeeper? Are those ax are there other axles that can fit? He's got the clicky axle. Um, I don't know if there is. I don't know if there's axle housing upgrades. Uh, the only thing that I've seen people do is actually just swap to AR44 axles, SCX102, because they basically bolt right up and they're just a lot better gear. Uh, so if I was going to do anything, I would find, I would even just find stock SCX102 axles, and I think that would be an upgrade. And they look a little better. Feisty goat. One of my faves, I have to say. You're, I've not seen him comment before, but I love my goats. So it's, um, that's a good way to get alcohol poisoning. What? To take a shot every time I come yeah. to an idiot. <laughs> and Jessica's two girls, do you have a VS410? Go fish. <laughs> What's the appeal of the 18th scale? Why not just go 110th or 124th? Um, so I, in most cases, totally agree. Uh, I, I much prefer the larger scale stuff, uh, especially driving experience. But I know a lot of people, they like to crawl them indoors, special, you know, 
weather dependent, things like that. Uh, and in general, I mean, this is a $130 kit. That's pretty cheap compared to a, a basic one tenth scale might cost you 300 at least. And honestly, the one tenth scale stuff is much more likely to need upgrades at that price range. Tina Louise says, finally got my first set of Vanquish rims. KMC Bull is very nice machine work. Nice. Very nice. Um, uh, Dale grew up around Arlington. I've never been to the, I've never been to Seattle. I haven't either. You have? No. I thought you went up there. I've been to Portland. I've Portland. Been to gotcha. Yeah. Um, are 10-3 straight axles any better than 10-2 straight axles in any way? Uh, they have an offset diff. That's really the only, you know, the only benefit is that they have an offset diff, which a lot of people, including myself, think does look better. But they also then have limited upgrades. But he also wants to put outboard motors on <laughs> the S410 that had flexi all over, so he's a fucking idiot. <laughs> um, Vanquish All Crawler. Can I get a set of rims for my UDR? Uh, we made short course wheels at one time. And does this have a transmitter? Yeah. Yep. Me and the same buddy were driving our trucks down the rocks and I looked over and saw a pair of pants folded neatly on a rock. I was like, what the fuck? Says Ryan Davis. I think hmm. that's back from when he was at Elephant Rock. That's I mean folded nicely is the like hmm. <laughs> like Scott lives in Snow, Snohomish? Snohomish? Snoh Snohomish? Snohomish. Just a little bit south of Arlington. Hey. Well, we rental cars were stupid expensive. So yeah, a rental car was going to be like $600. It's like 160 some odd dollars a day for a basic. Yeah. So we are. So we're. I tried shuttle. to talk him into getting a limo because I've never. Well, I've ridden in a limo one time, but it was my grandma's funeral. I was like five, so um I was try I tried. <laughs> that would be the dumbest shit ever to pull up to somebody else's wedding in a limo. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm officiating it, so You are, yeah, but you're you're not getting married. I mean so. <laughs> like Perry G's gave us $5. Thank you. If you wanted to build another small rig, I would have gladly sent more my Orlando, especially since it's your Not habit. Not a chance. I'm pretty sure I mother effed that thing the whole time I built mine. So the fact that you still bought it, that's on you. <laughs> uh, oh, there's lots of... Oh, Dale's moving to the home. No, no. How is that? Ha, ha, someone said, "Is that close to Artisiba?" <laughs> that man, Snahamish. That's one of those ones that. Oh, that's gonna suck because every time you call somebody and you have to give them your address, they're gonna. It's one of those ones what? like, can you can you uh, can you go ahead and just spell that out? Say what? Because that's not a real place. Um, ninety one pro. He works at Vanquish, and he said he brought. He said, do you own Vanquish? Just curious. I bought some links for my Wraith spawn and they're awesome. Hey, I do. I work there and they're every day. Blacksmith RC, thanks for joining. Snow ho Snow Homish? Snow Homish. Interesting. All right. Front bumper is on. I have to tell you, bumper doesn't quite fit as well as it does on a regular VS410. A wide may need some some trimming. It's a Tell pretty wide body. Come down here in Alabama, and I'll rent you a cow five dollars a day. I'll fill up the tank for you. <laughs> I prefer horses, <laughs> but I I do love love me some Alabama. Yep. Is Vanquish ever going to make SCX10 two F9 front axles? They've been out of stock forever. Mm, they haven't been out of stock forever. They were in stock last week. <laughs> I believe some people in here even got them. Josh, you could totally use my truck while you're here. This is Dale. I wish we had more time to spend because there's a shit ton of people from Washington. Yeah. That we would, you know, but we are going for a very close friend's wedding. So there's a rental car supported. Yeah. That I was 
thinking that was pretty evident while I was shopping. Like, well, this is... That sounded like hill fever. We're goddamn ridiculous. Um, I want to crawl inside, but I want more of a T-Rex for one tenth scale crawl feel. Should I cancel the order? I just put in for an SCX 24 Deadbolt and buy this builder kit instead. Um, I wouldn't say that yet. This, I'm just, this was a kit. So I was like, oh, I'll try that out. Um, I don't. I think that the SCX24 is still probably one of the, the, the go-tos. So I'm not, I would not tell you to cancel that. that. Um, I didn't buy it. My wife did for Christmas after she heard you mention it on a live stream. <laughs> this is why you shouldn't pick players on a big stream where everyone can hear. Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy King gave us $5. Thank you, sir. We Jimmy. appreciate it. Thanks, sir. Don't try to pronounce it. I live up here in Silk Camp. We have so many Washington people. Yeah. We'll come back. We will come back for sure. Look at all this. They're all like, drive down to Tacoma RC Raceway, come in and tell you, oh my God, hey. Oh my God, hey. Squints is up there too? Yeah, everyone is. Jeez. J King RC, literally everyone. I'm like, we will, we will I mean, our super Wait. good friends live in Olympia, so, yep. which is not crazy far from Seattle. No. So. Definitely worth a day trip for some RCing. Right? I just want to, I always. You just want to meet people. I just, I just like to meet people. I just like. And that is why I listen with earbuds now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we had to assemble. Squints Palidoris is in Olympia. Didn't you oh. sign a truck in Olympia? Uh, uh, yeah. What? That was at, uh, I was at KTM Hobby, and it was for a giveaway for up there. Um, and that was uh, Glenn Taylor. I'm pretty sure that's, I'm terrible with names, but I'm pretty sure that's correct. Nacogdoches. Nacogdoches. Try that's that. Texas, right? Uh, yes, and I have. Isn't that in a movie? I have a good, uh, Kelly is from. Well, I definitely don't know it because oh. of that. But no, oh, I think it's in like a. From there. That's why I know Nacogdoches. Oh, oh, I think, isn't Nacogdoches like the. Uh, isn't the guy from, God, who was the guy from Castaway? Tom Hanks? Yeah. Tom Hanks, he played a congressman or a senator who was from that area in a movie about like Iran-Contra or something like that. I can't remember. Mark gave us $10. Thank you, sir. If I slip you a 10 spot, can you tip me off next time some the F9 axles will be in stock so I can buy one before they're gone? <laughs> Unfortunately, well, not, I mean, I should say that. I am running or kind of trying to take over the uh, Swiss machine side of our shop. So I have brought in my customer service guy to help take over my previous position while I focus on that. So that is unfortunately taking me away from a lot of the production following um ron starner said are them beadlock tires yes something's war randall hill said something's war something's uh char yeah charlie wilson's war there it is there you go good movie <laughs> alex said oh i'm jealous of them pnw trails I competed at in maybe I, no, that wasn't Seattle. That was Portland, I think. What? Where I went up for scale nationals that year, like 20. that was Oregon, yeah. Yeah. I know I was at your parents for some reason. I was. You I were, just I just went down to stay with your parents for that weekend. Did you? Yeah. Huh. Yes. Some brass inside my tars. Everybody lives in freaking Washington. It is beautiful there. Washington is beautiful. I had a blast up there. Nicole, I think instead of money for the live stream, we should send wine to help you go. The only problem is, is that the next day, she's just like. I'm like, he's like, aren't you going to do laundry? And I'm like, 
I did your live stream. Yeah. <laughs> like, it like becomes the like, nope, no, I'm not doing anything. No, I did your live stream. I'm done. <laughs> we're we're done. <laughs> we're even. Yeah, like you do laundry. Pick me up, motherfucker. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Eric Baker gave us language. Five dollars. Um Thank you. Josh, is a Swiss machine production for the Ripper 2 project? <laughs> Bitch. I was like, oh, so the... Ah. Oh. Jesse says, Josh should learn how to run them fancy computer machines. <laughs> Have you ever bought Tamaya parts? Lots and lots of them. I mean, made Tamaya parts. Oh, no. <laughs> Patrick. Good night. I can't. He's from Sweden. I can't say his... I don't know how to say it. What would you do to a TRX4 to make it a better crawler, Josh? So make this, but better. Make this, but better. Um, I did the, uh, Matt and I both did a budget build on the TRX4 where we did like 16 weeks worth of videos going through all of our process on that. So that would make uh, the best playlist for you in that case, because you can see all of it. It's going to be a lot of watching though. Twisted Dwarfs as I'm drunk watching through one eye. You guys rock. <laughs> These tires are very well sealed with almost no sidewall support. We're going to have to put a hole in those. Josh, learn how to do laundry. Nah. Pass. <laughs> Next suggestion. <laughs> Kitties are wonderful. So he's sleeping in a box. I don't know where Chief is. Chiefy. I don't know. And Sappy's out there. Sleeping in the heated bed. Yeah, in her in her queen's bed. Yeah. Did you get to test the new Reefs 8800 IS winch? Mine comes Monday. I did not. That is not one that I... I don't do a lot of winching. So unless I really need it for something, I really don't pick them up. Can we talk about winching? Winching, yes. First time I saw that. Oh my God. The first time you saw it was in Alabama. Yeah. Right before scale was it? It was a crawl. It was crawler nationals. Right, not it was not scale. I mean, the scale wasn't a big thing back then. Like yeah, it was not a very big thing. And I apologize if you're the one, um, but I saw somebody winch out somebody else from whatever and tow them back to their tent or van or whatever they had. Why did you say, why did it have to be a van? Like, like their pit trailer, pit van, whatever. Fuck you. I... <laughs> had to be a van, huh? Just, this person automatically all of a sudden drives a van. I mean, <laughs> probably. And I was like. You came running. I, I, I thought, like, oh I, I thought somebody God. was chasing you. I just saw somebody, like they could have picked it up. And carried it, but no, somebody else towed them back to their van or whatever. <laughs> and it was just like, I was like in shock, like. Because it was like 2012 or 13, maybe. What am I doing? Maybe not. No, it would have been 2011. No. What year it would have been. I've got to put holes in these because they're sealed and they just collapse and stay that way. Eric Baker gave us $5. Thank you. We're going to put a that tiny hole in si the sidewall. So what color are you going to paint them on? Is Josh allowed to play with the appliances? He has an engineering degree. He can, absolutely. He just chooses not to. True. Refuse not to. No, you choose. Stupid. <laughs> What is the post roller called they install on top of a car for a winch and side hilling? Um, I don't know if there's a real name for it. People just use it like it's, they're just calling it a pivot or something. Alex says he does laundry and cleans cat box. I has been paid for people to do laundry before I came around. And after when you weren't around. Well, yeah, when you lived out here without me. Yeah. You're a psycho. And now the it's now honestly the it's not that person that he's marrying next weekend is the one who the per the person who lived I lived with. Yeah. 
when I moved out here, I just rented a room for somebody from somebody until uh, Nicole moved out. Yeah. And, and they, he became one of our very best friends on the entire world. So it works. Um, Brian gave us $2 power suggestion is working. Brian. Matthew jorgensen has been doing his own laundry for 40 years now. I'm definitely capable. I just feel like there's so many other things I could be doing in that time frame that would, like. Yeah, the only time we've heard of Josh touching an appliance is when he baked RC tires in the oven. It's the only time he's touched it. And he was probably, I use the stove. And he was probably like, how did this happen? How do you do this? I use the stove. The stove is the top part. The oven's the bottom part. I'm aware. I use the stove. No, you use the oven. I use the... Oh, no, no. For the tires, yes. But I'm just saying I use the stove Oh, regularly. you know how to boil water for tea. Regularly. Ass hat. And oatmeal. Oh, my God. I love the kettle. <laughs> you know how to boil the kettle. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> so, I'm, I, I'm well aware that I'm fully capable. I just don't... Feel like it's what I should focus on. Yeah, he uses the stove to eat up water for his fancy tea. A fancy, a fancy Lipton tea. You can't. He paid for so I don't. Now he doesn't. No, when, now I don't. Yeah, just when she didn't live out here, because yeah. I lived out here for almost a year before she moved out here. I moved out in January. She moved out at Thanksgiving. When my Jeep got stolen, and we, then we broke down in the trailer broke in Kingman, Arizona. He can't even no, he can't even make mac and cheese. He'd be like, I could so milk. What's milk? I don't know how to do this. For one, we don't have milk. We have coconut milk. Or oat milk. You bought oat milk once. That was the worst thing ever. Yeah, no, it was like oatmeal. It was oatmeal 100%. water. One hundred percent. It was oat. It was like the water you get from your oatmeal. One hundred percent. That was disgusting. No, it wasn't even like the water you get from your oatmeal because you use milk in oatmeal. Yeah, but it was like no. Yeah, it was no. It was the worst. What's the make of the soldering pin you use on the flex seal truck? Oh, um, I've got two. I've got one that's just from Amazon. It was called the. Uh, TS100, and then I've got one from a company called like Squire or something like that, or Secure. Oh my. I don't know, they're basically all the same. There's no titties on oats. Say what? There's no titties <laughs> on oats. <laughs> I was um, like, I, that's what I heard, and I was like, wait, what? Jesse Jesse hid that one. <laughs> you can unhide that one. That's funny. <laughs> oh, my daughters went vegetarian and drink almond milk now. I'm, I don't mind almond milk. I'm allergic to almonds, yeah. so. I don't... Like, almond milk isn't as offensive to me. Soy milk's okay. Regular, We do have regular milk. We just try to drink as little of it as possible. We don't have regular milk. In California. Oh, out here. Yeah, we do. But we just try to drink as little as, little as possible. So we, I think we settled on the coconut milk, yeah? It's fine. Yeah. Coconut milk's fine. So. I would rather have regular milk, but. Me too. But we don't have to vent the rears because the, the wheels are vented, but the alum the uh, brass rings. No one gives a shit. I'm this is valuable tech. Like, literally, no one's watching. The, you. This valuable tech information is still happening here. Literally, no one cares about this truck. You don't know. When are y'all coming back to KC? Say hi to Jay and I at Hobby Haven. Also, yes. hi. <sighs> I don't know sure when our, October. Yeah, I don't know when our next for sure trip. It, uh, well, yeah, October, October for sure. But we will. Um, Kingman seems to be a known breakdown spot hmm. in me and my friend group. Yeah, we uh, a, a leaf sprung. The leaf spring broke on our trailer. And it poga. It fell down, and the whole trailer went, boom, came back down. One. Well, that was fun. We're just here for the kitten. Well, one kitten's asleep. I wonder who the other kitten is. I should probably find him. Stay there, duckling. Let's see. I was a snake milker. Very hard to find snake nipple. <laughs> yeah, 
<laughs> no, I was reading comments. I was reading comments. Oh. Do chickens have nuggets? This is why Nicole reads comments, because I see these and get distracted. <laughs> Tiniest of wheel screws. Hi, Suck. You were gone for the maximum amount of time Sookie could be away from you. She's following. Dang it. When is the painting starting? Soon. No one's commented on the white lights, how much they like the white lights. Mm. Did they comment on your purple choice? No, mm. because you did. Oh. You mentioned it. Yeah, but there's likely people that weren't here at that time. Don't you, don't you know? Don't you know? Don't Brian you know? Bobo 55 says, as a retired bulk milk truck driver, I don't understand how people drink nut juice. <laughs> 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 it's just funny to call it that. I don't. I mean, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I, mean, I just think it's comical. If not, it's good. Marco Sarcy says my wife likes purple light. Don't make her watch this shit. <laughs> <laughs> what or what shade of orange will you finger paint this pile? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, where's that flip pin? He's fine. Why is it so white? I work for Tillamook Creamery. <gasps> he lives in my neighbor growing up, who was like a second grandmother to me. They moved to Tillamook and she would always send us Tillamook cheese. Now you can buy it in the grocery store and it's my favorite. Um, What KV brushless motors did you end up going with for the out? <sighs> Damn. For the what? With that, for the outboards. Just... It was only one choice. I don't even know which ones they were. We're just going to send it. Randall says, purple's my favorite color. I love it. That backlight is pretty dope. But I was, I made him set the other ones to white because then you can see the trucks better, I feel like. Oh, well, that's a bummer. Great. The window mask got stuck to the back of the stickers. It's like you were going to use it. I <laughs> could have, but don't, I think I need to actually. Cheese ice cream. I love Tillamont. That they cut. Cheddar that you guys sell is everything. The the I usually buy it for a recipe, but then I end up eating it. So, because you're a child. Yeah, I mean, if I could survive on cheese alone, I... if you could survive on cheese and cookie dough. Do you think the RC manufacturers are messing with you by always sending you the not orange option? <laughs> yes. There's... The purple makes Josh look like purple Jesus of first. <laughs> Did you, have you driven the sidecar yet? No, I have not. You're such a loser. Why? I'm busy. Did you build that truck wreck? No, I can't. Would you call that straight? Ish. Ish? Yeah. Ish. How is he going to color a child and can't do laundry or boil water? I can boil water fine. I'm good at it. Yeah. But seriously, where did they go? I'm, it makes me nervous when it's quiet in this house. Yeah? They're fine. We're gonna have we're gonna be done and done her so fast. You're gonna be Oh, there she is. Where's your little one? Where's your little one? Huh? Dale C, that is a thick girl. You were just having that conversation. Oh. What? Tell them factory is a tourist attraction. Really? Yeah. Well, I mean, the, what's the Osceola Cheese Factory? You ever been to that one? Also a tourist attraction right down there in Osceola, Osceola Missouri. <laughs> you, ever, you ever go, get yourself some cheese curds. You've been to the Cheese Factory. You know it. 
I mean, you have to. I have a full load of Wisconsin cheese on right now. I had to drop in Missouri. Oh, you remember? Uh, I sold a truck to a guy who his wife was a cheese connoisseur from Wisconsin. Yes. And he sent us some very nice aged cheddar, like I mean, an like, eight, a 10 and a 12 year aged like sharp six cheddar. Six different cheeses and like sausages. And it was just like. It was incredible. And it was honestly like my first experience with like prop, like aged cheddar that was, and it was absolutely like the most amazing thing. However, Nicole and I were getting migraines for a couple of days. So we get migraines. With and we're just like. This has tannins. Aged cheese has tannins in it. Yeah. Like wine. And uh, we didn't find that out until Nicole did some Googling. And it was like, oh, yeah, it's that fancy cheese that, that happens. That making us incredibly sick. But we, we still ate We it. still ate like a little bit at a time. Yeah. <laughs> like, I guess it, it means so we can good. only have. It crystals in it. It was like. Oh, it was delicious. Amazing. It was incredible. So yeah, keep up the good work there, Tilma. Um, I Is he in here? Because it sounds like oh, he is. He's sleeping in the corner. Oh, sweet baby. I heard his purring all the way up here. I recently purchased. Uh, shouldn't Josh wash that before he applied the window mask? Beard. Why do you even try? I recently purchased a secondhand SCX-10-3 with Vanquish axles. One of the rear portal covers is bent. Are they available separately or should I attempt to straighten them myself? Um, they are not available separately normally. Uh, but with something like that, you can send customer service an email and they may be able to sell you one separately. Um, but that's not something you'll find on the website. I've never seen one bent. That's impressive. Uh, yep, definitely should have washed that. Um, I definitely didn't. There's a lot of people who make cheese. Make part. cheese? Yeah. Like grilled cheese? No, like actual cheese. Wow. Driving three kids a quite is a disaster level indicator. Yeah. Dale says, I live by Lake Washington. I saw a sheriff boat getting fuel. The motors on those are way overpowered, so they installed three of them. That's how I imagine the toy boda would be. Can't wait. I See, I'm thinking that it's not going to be crazy powered because, ooh, that's a good scratch. <laughs> I'm so, I don't know, maybe it's just that I'm a little ham fisted for painting. I have some scorpion pepper cheese. I'm pretty sure that's what hate tastes like. Ooh. We have been to the cheese shop I have in Sutter Creek, and it is fantastic. My parents went bananas because they love their cheese. Um. Wait, what is the tape for? Don't you just pour paint in and swish it around? Problem, I would if my paint didn't come in cans. Rub some alcohol in there. Okay. We'll try that. Watch the mass wash off now. How about an RC crawl and wine tasting in a vineyard? Perry G? His wife works for a vineyard. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is Josh doing what I think he's doing? No. What? What? Do you? Oh, I agree. It's going to be a fancy anchor, but it's going to be a marvel of engineering. Everyone's like, yeah, it's super easy to make cheese. Who? Is it like people who make their own beer, though? Because Doubt it. that's rarely all that great. Jiffy McSchlitz, you must be from the Midwest because I agree with you. Cheese Whiz does come in a jar. Easy cheese is in a can. Yeah. And I didn't know that until I think I was with you. And because I Because I make a casserole that has cheese was in it and drawers. There's and the most Midwest shit you've ever heard. <laughs> Let me bring you a casserole with some cheese whiz. Two, two cans of cheese whiz, two sticks of butter, 
<laughs> two bags of broccoli, two bags of rice is the best thing you've ever had. A little bit of flax seed, so it's healthy. <laughs> Steve, one time Steve said, no, he's from Orangeville. Same diff. Um, one, I made it for Thanksgiving when we were out here one year and Steve was like, that's the best thing I've ever had. And I was like, I will not tell you what that is. <laughs> <laughs> I will not tell you. They still sell it, but you have to search for it. Cheese Whiz? Yeah, in the jar. Yeah. You have to search for it because I have to search for it when I, the one time a year I make green rice casserole. All right. Now for the fun. And there is two cans of cream and mushroom. Oh my God. Alex said, Puck, does that sound like Midwest food? Any cream and mushroom in it? Two cans of cream and mushroom soup. <laughs> two cans of cream. Let's see. Metallic blue. If we do the blue, we'd have to back it. I'm not doing that. How do you order the various sizes of titanium links on the Vanquish site? I only see three sizes listed that I can actually buy. Yeah, that's because we don't make them anymore, and those are the only ones that are left, and then they will be gone. Okay. Um, what color? Oh, are you really going to paint it? Yeah. Those are the only colors you have? Well, I mean, I have... I have some others, but they would take, like, extra steps. So these are the only colors I have. We're doing a one one and done here. Um, yeah. What? That one. Which one? Let's see. My only experience was homemade cheese with my sister slaved over homemade cheesy mac and cheese. I didn't know. I said it tastes like Velveeta. We're going great. It tastes great. amazing. I got murdered by her. During Prohibition, Paps Beer thought they would have to shut down, but the other brother used the equipment to make cheese. I saw a thing on the History Channel Not about orange, that. green, yellow. He used them all in a fade. <laughs> green, green. We're going green. Green, yellow. PS8. Green. Wow, a lot of greens. Oh, chili and yeah. Velveeta, yeah, for sure. I mean, that's how I make cheese dip. Velveeta. Oh, yeah, that's the best. Yeah. Rotel, Velveeta, and uh, hamburger meat. Yeah, no, that's like the best cheese dip for sure. All right. I'll be right back. Are you for real? No, don't do that. Yeah. You want me to do it in here? You don't need to paint it right now. I'm going to paint it. We're going to be done. It's only 730. This is going to take no time. I'll be right back. Read some comments. Yeah, he's not painting in the house. He will die. Huh. I didn't know cheese was so easy to make. I thought he was going to paint in the house as well. That Rotel and chili and cheese dip is like liquid Oklahoma. Or Kansas or Missouri. <laughs> so tell us more about your casseroles and hot dishes. Hot dishes is northern or it's for northern. Hi from Salinas Valley. Can we talk? So how are things going for you? Great. Gonna let her dry for just a minute. You did not. You're so full of shit. There's zero chance you painted that. I swear to God. It's outside the front door on the right. Why'd you put it out the front? Because that's where I painted it. There we go. So is this one the oxygen bridge? <laughs> okay. Gee. Jeez. He's not doing it. I'm definitely not doing it though. That fast, there's no way. I you saw it, it's fully dripping, it's pretty thick. And yeah, and what did you paint it on? My hands over the rose bush. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, we'll even we'll probably do a second coat quick. And I'll, maybe I'll even back it with some silver. Psh, 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 psh. Psst, psst. 
done. All right. I'm telling you, we're going to knock yeah, this. Yeah, he's like the queen of hearts. Who's what? Who? Who's you. that? Me? Painting, yeah, painting the roses. Queen of hearts. From, from Alice in Wonderland? Yeah. She painted roses? Yeah. Kind of Harry like... G gave us five dollars. Thank you, Nicole. Red, white, or sparkling, sweet or dry. Amy wants to send you wine. I'll send it to Josh's work. <laughs> you don't have to do that. <laughs> you don't have to do that. But really, white and dry. Um, but we'll come see you guys. Let's see. Are you gonna? Are people gonna see this run? Yeah. We'll probably. I'll drive it in here before we are done. Painted and done. You see? And then, who knows? <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know. Maybe it's something really cool I don't even know about. <laughs> Bet the body's gone when Josh checks. <laughs> Thick first layer, light second layer equals professional, right? Find the spots you missed. Yeah, hit them start, one. start charging batteries. The battery's in the car. Where's the car? It's right here. Little one. I bet this came with a bit of a charge anyway. We could, you know what? We can just check that out right now. I already plugged her in. What's up? Oh, you haven't seen an RC car run yet. How do I turn this stupid thing on? On. It came with everything except the batteries for this. Oh, I bet they're triple A. Raccoons add the second coat of paint. Her <laughs> Jeep is green now. It just has a green body print on it. He is a handsome little boy, isn't he? Your boy? He's pretty handsome. And he's Your boy? pretty sweet. He is sweet and calm. Very calm. Yeah. Using incision 90 millimeter shocks on a custom Clodbuster build. Any suggestions on what weight shock will to use? Clodbuster, go heavy. Go 90 or 100 weight. That's not Um, how do I, yeah, get... when's the new element coming out? Uh, we should see information on it tomorrow or close. How the actual, I've seen this radio moment of truth. Will Dom attach Got it. or flee in terror? What's up, Bubba? They were calling him Dom. I know. Hmm. El Jefe. <sighs> Needs a yellow stripe. Needs a yellow stripe. Josh needs some double A's as a special double A drawer. They are triple A. I knew it. We have no triple A's member. We just had this conversation. I know, but what did I end up getting them uh, for? I needed four for something looks else. Like his tail's bolted on, said Alex. <laughs> Not for long. Let's see. Um I needed triple A's for something. Oh, oh. Build it, paint it, and auction it off all in one show. There's two. Can I see it's 10 axle gear spit in the enduro axles? Nope. Totally different. Totally different. No, so sorry, Charlie. Now you're in the box? No, you live in the box? Okay. Four double A's. Triple A's. I've got two dollar dumb freaks fuck out then comes back to sniff. <laughs> that was the new kitty. That is the new kitty. But he does look so much like Suck. Like, I can't tell them apart. Did you stop making wraith parts? Um, no, not not a lot of them. Some of them we did. Okay. Bound and everything. Let's crawl over Phoenix's wheels. Oh my god. He's watching. Is he going to come to attack? Is that you want to see it? Got nice, some nice wheel speed. Uh 
we'll start now. You gotta let him up there. Don't let don't hold him back. I'm holding him back. I'm just holding him. What do you think? Like that's not natural. She's like, I would like to kill that. He. Good boy. Okay, let's go throw a second coat on. It's been a while. Where did you get this from? A main. I linked it in the description. You can play around. Here you. Yeah. The RC Underdog gave us ten dollars. Thank you. Just got done grinding some drive shafts and making sway for links. Thanks for the pleasant ambiance. Pleasant. I don't know about that. What do you think about that, TV? What do you think? This is actually the most I've ever done. I think he said the kit has some upgrades, that this kit has some upgrades. Versus, I don't know. What are you doing? This cat has got some big ass paws. He is going to be a monster. Get it. Get it, little brother. All right. We're done with the green. Everyone's like, is this the most you've ever played with RC car? I'm like, you have no idea. This actually is. <laughs> yeah, actually a true story. Yeah. And we'll back her with some silver here in a minute after she gets good and dry. There's zero chance that's dry. Yep. Um. <sighs> what do you think? What do you think? Consecration from Russian River Brewing Company. That's a good boy. The kitty, he's like, what, how, five months old? He's five months old. And yeah, yeah, fine. So um, he's got some big old feet on him, though. That I just said. Oh nope, thank That's you. That's just a bind plug. Okay. I got plenty. I bet he's gonna get silver swirling in there. What was that? It's his butt sitting on a keyboard. What's up? Tie some cat boys to the back of that. Oh my god. I like your cat's balls. <laughs> Said a spider monkey. <laughs> I'm gonna come to you like a spider monkey. I'm all Matt jacked Harley. up on Mountain Dew. All right. So after the body's done, we just gotta we gotta add all the body details, like the grill and the head, headlight, taillight, mirrors. Oh, wow. You're really getting into this. We're going to be done and dunner. This is definitely basically like a knockoff VS410 grill. I mean, that's a compliment. Is Ripper 2 pre-order pay drop yet? No pre-orders. No, no. You'll only be able to buy them as soon as they're done. Just hold your breath. <laughs> Just go ahead and start holding your breath now. Yeah. And then when you wake up, you'll probably be Did ready. you show Matt what you bought off an of infomercial? I didn't buy it off an infomercial. It's an infomercial. I bought the contour gauge. I saw the commercials on my solitary game. Well, that doesn't make it an infomercial. That's just an advertisement. So. Did, it, you, did you show Matt? I did not show Matt. Oh, he's gonna be so sad. That he didn't think of getting a contour he gauge? He didn't get to see it. That's, I don't think that's. No, that's not, it's a flat surface. Yeah. I'm aware. Oh, I'm yeah. aware. 
What drag car custom chassis, which is best? Um, I've only ever used the Renegade chassis, so I don't really have a, I don't have a wide variety of knowledge. Um, the Arrow cars seem to be fast. The Undercover Drag Wings is the one that I have, and it's fun. Benjamin Grassnick said my wife got me one of those for Christmas. I bet she plays solitaire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There you go. So if you need to trace it, it's just right there. I mean, I think it's cool. I thought I showed you. I thought it was cool. I don't know why I need it. You don't. But you never know. I might. I might could. <laughs> you were like, I think they have a smaller one. And then you just bought this one. That might be true. Oh, we're dropping friends. <clears throat> and so. Will the Facebook page be the same for Ripper 2 as the original Ripper? Or the Ripper 2 get its own page? God. How much yard work would I have to do for jo Nicole to give me one of Josh's VS410 trucks? I mean, there's a lot. <laughs> like, <laughs> I would give you one at this point. <laughs> there's a lot. <laughs> Use a hair dryer for quick dry. No. Um. It's out. It's right out there, isn't it? No. If not, you lying to me? If you can't do laundry, could you at least pick up all those frames you're dropping? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's done now. It's yes. Um, no, but if, if someone actually cleaned up my yard, my backyard, I would give them whatever. But yes, I would kill him if he touched my $200 hair dryer. <laughs> Do you like them? Are they hard? Yeah, you think... Josh's new fidget tool. Yes, right? Look at this shape. Ooh. <laughs> I suppose we could. I think Josh should build them, Nicole can drive them, and the cats chase them. I don't think you'd get very far. So, we might as well. Throw the old battery on. By the there. way, Josh, the Chupa is still in FedEx No Man's Land. Hope Dan insured it for big bucks. Um, like when you say that. dropping frames, does it YouTube tell you that, or is it a separate program? Uh, we have a, a feedback that tells us that if they're is if it you... USB charged? Yes. Well, that's cool. It's. I mean, it's. It's like the cheapy way of doing things. Oh, well, I think that's cool. Right. I have a USB extension that's routed right to the edge of my desk here, so I can just... I'm out of here, Nicole. It's not bad. Damn raccoons, though. They're still doing it. Yeah, of course my hair dryer has variable heat. Yeah. Of course. Of course. But, I mean, I get them at cost from... But, like... A hair dryer was my life, blood. Oh, come on, you little bastard. I'm not cleaning the backyard. Josh peed out there. <laughs> Maybe. He needs to do it again. I think there's another one come unplugged. It's staying that way. Somebody will do it for the little gray truck behind me? Sure. You just zip it. <laughs> A very nice truck. Which truck? I don't care. <laughs> I'm getting my yard clean. Three day charger. Three day charger. Yeah, exactly. They take forever. You know what else can be a USB charge? Batteries for an Orlando. <laughs> All right. I think she's dry. I'm going to go shoot some silver on it. Can you not? You couldn't even tell the green was on the bushes. They're green. <laughs> I mean, I just think that's cool. I don't know why. And it's nice to not have to listen to that stupid charger beep all the time. I hate listening to that battery charger beep. obnoxious okay 
I don't know what I'm having for dinner. Not that anyone asked, but I was just thinking about it. The one below the green truck, front and backyard. Our front yard's taken care of. It's just the backyard that needs, but there's also fruit trees, but the milk thistle is uh, higher than the rose bushes. How do I like my litter robot? I love it. It's amazing. Changed my life. Yeah, Harry G, I agree. I'm sure that that body is going to look terrible, but whatever. I will cut your hair and give you a bra wax for okay. my yard. It'll be, it'll be dry in 10 minutes. Can Josh put his hand under the truck? Bet he won't. Can we all just spam Ripper 2 in the chat? No. You could. It's not going to have any difference. <laughs> no. nope. So the mask may have lifted a little bit in one corner, but this window trim looks, I think it's going to do perfect. We're going to be in good shape. This is going to be so good. I know a local guy that does yard cleanup cheap right here. BT is here. Hello, Nicole. Did you hey, hello? BT. No, he did not send me a message. I've been looking for you. So. Send him a message. Yeah, battery charged. Beep. Battery connected. Beep. No battery connected. Beep. Just once. No. Beep. 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 Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying how I hate listening to your battery charger. So yeah. So this one's fine. Yeah. That's the thing. It kick on the regular ones that wind up like a jet is taking off. So it's always in a hotel room when we're at a event and it's just like, and it's the middle it's at night and we're both like starting to fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did you catch RC Patina guy on the red cat stream? I did not. Oh, I did not. When was it? Must was it must have been during the day? If it was during the day, I was likely busy. I only see things if they're at night. Let's Yeah. Okay. So we've got headlights, tail lights, and then we're done. Some Peel stickers. the mask before the paint fully dries. Ooh. What shock oil though? Um Cod liver. Once your bank, once you vanquish boys, figure out cutting breaks. A rip or two will be needed. Oh my god! What does that mean? Cutting breaks. It's like an old XR10 joke. Josh, you still use ninety weight in your eighty millimeter shocks in your ultra? Yep, I do. Josh, can totally build a crawler course back there. I'm fine with that, but get rid of the weeds and shit. BT gave us got... twenty dollars. I want my wheels. I don't know who you are. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> I knock to fan my swapped my chargers. So nice. Oh, good idea. Knock to is a brand that makes computer fans. Oh, and they they're way don't quieter. Beep. No, the fan isn't what makes the beep, but they don't make the jet engine sound as much. Oh, I hate that too. Yeah. So you know we could. We can start hopping up our chargers. Oh, you know what? I do have a brand new charger right here. There's a our indoor crawl somewhere here. Uh, RNH hobby. Yeah, this uh, has been a fun one. Almost happy my back is hurting too bad to have gone to the RNH for the indoor. Crawl. Yeah, and it's always it's on Fridays and Wednesdays, the two nights I have streams. So I got this new uh, Genzace charger. It's the like their Mars 2 charger or something like that. Is there a secret Facebook club for people that buy the pit mat and parts tray? <laughs> we should, tr let's try this. I wonder if it'll charge from a balance port only. James Kettner can turn the beep off on his charger. Well, we're about to find out if this Gen's Ace one's noisy. What do you think about that? I haven't tried it yet. That's Don't be Josh me, a horologist checking in. Yes. <gasps> we have everybody. I know. 
of everybody. Everybody does everything. It's so cool. I love it. Like, I, oh, I know horologist. Yeah, of course. But I'm just saying, like, no, we've like, got. I know. Like, you can say that. Like, oh, yeah, I know a horologist. Yeah. Right. Cheesemakers? Right. By the dozens. Yeah, a question? Let me ask my. It's super easy to <laughs> Let me ask my people. <laughs> yeah. Um, what are your TRX4 build videos called to make it more capable? Uh, the TRX4 budget build. There's a whole playlist with both Matt's and I's videos in there. So you only have to look in one spot to find both. Uh, I have a playlist on my channel. You can put that on the Ender 5, the, that fan. What fan? My new printer came this week. And that one is going to Brandon's tomorrow. Is it quiet? The new printer? Yeah. Even quieter than that one. Fan fucking fantastic. I see what you did there. Because you know how bad I hate that. You, I she's that so one. sensitive to yeah. the sound of. He said, don't take me off with TIC. I can clean your cloth. <laughs> okay. I know. Not a success. Like, like So many unboxing videos, Josh. Damn you all. Hi from Dublin. Hello. Hello. Ooh, discharge. Nope. We're going to go to custom car charge. fabricator here. Ask me anything. Nice. Can what you custom this? fab me a car? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, B G R D B C H X G X J. Big red bitch. Yeah. Jeremiah Silver gave us five dollars. Thank you. It's gonna be a fun night. Somehow the guard shack at work is unusable. Get to sit in my car all night. Also have you two try Death Wish Coffee. That is um okay. Jesse yeah. Schultz. Scrap battery, voltage low. Oh my god, that's terrible. Maybe it's because it's not actually plugged. I thought I was Did hoping it maybe it could just aircraft mechanic. Would you call the CR18 a good beginner build? I mean, the oh, the most simple of beginner builds, really, because there just isn't that many. The only thing is, is that they don't label the length of the screws you're supposed to leave or use. And that part of it is a little bit of a bummer. Good day from Melbourne. Have your fingers recovered from removing flex steel yet? Fortunately, yes. Let's go... Cell balance, will that do it alone? No. Oh my God, you're so annoying. What? I'm learning. And knowledge is power. Western Washington. I would get your tire fixed for one of Josh's RCs. Damn it. It doesn't work. Okay. Want to know why medical bills are expensive? Did hospital bills for seven years? I'm super noise sensitive at night. My 3D printer ended up in the garage. I can't handle the server. Thank you. Uh oh, somebody's gonna have a tornado warning here in a bit. Dang it. Well, I can't use this new battery charger because it doesn't have a <laughs> big cannabis kind of sore. Bummer. It doesn't work for this one? Well, because I don't have the plug. And I was hoping I could just do a balance charge, but it just only does cell balancing. Hobo oh. here, ask me anything. Hobo. Do you know Justice? What was his no. name? Liberty Justice. Liberty Justice. He was a. He was a friend of ours dad who was the hobo king, king. hobo king yeah. in, in or somewhere in iowa where the giant hobo meetup is i don't know but he was right the king of where's hobo. the where's the hobo meetup I think david he might be joking even if he is you don't think he has google and he could answer it and be like of course i know i'm a hobo and if you're gonna joke follow through you're an idiot <laughs> i've heard they're milling a special coin for the ripper too it will have your Personal coat to gain access to the super secret club. <laughs> Bring back flip that truck. Yes. Oh, BT message. I need too. to do. Oh, thank you. I need to do that so that I can get rid of some truck. Um, Perry's a furniture builder. Ooh. Can we discuss reptiles? Reptile? Uh, reptiles. No, just power. Josh could use a workout. Yeah. 
you need the plug and balance plug. Yeah. Check. Oh, wow. What? Is it really dry? <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, lot lizards. <laughs> Len bow dries single malt whiskey. No, I have not. Oh, not reptiles. He was saying lot lizards, not reptiles. Finish the 50k giveaway. The truck is the truck part is done, but I think we are going to move on to a new painter. Iowa in August. Take the train and stay with my uncle every year, says David. There you go. Very cool. Uh, Nicole, I'm a woodworker. I specialize in architectural restoration, but do general woodworking and construction most of the time. He's local. Very, it's paid with you. What shade of orange do you call that? <laughs> Frank Sherwood gave us $2. Thank you. Has the rubber tube been announced on Facebook? Frank is the day that it is. Can you navigator. imagine how much shit I'm going to catch? Oh, I see the, I didn't see the lot part. I just saw this. Can we discuss? And I didn't see the lot, oh, lot yeah. part. Yeah. Hey Josh, I'm about to glue your grill for the J concepts grill on the body. The question is, since you don't like the creep, why did you design a grill for it? So stabby Josh. Because I, and I actually like the creep. Matt's the one who doesn't like the creep. That is why, because and I actually designed it for the bog hog, because the creep wasn't out yet. And where did you find the? Did I upload that to Thingiverse? Hmm. Dale, I agree. I couldn't have wall clocks in here either. They drive me crazy. Wall clock? Like yeah. The... Yeah. No. I haven't. Chainsaw says I haven't met a tree I can take down. I can't afford a ripper too. Can I just buy the coin? Did you enjoy your new Bronco yesterday? Uh, yeah, I kind of take it out this weekend. Any opinion on the new tracks Bronco? I mean, it's basically a TRX4, and if you like the body, then great. And the new body mounting system is pretty cool. So, shit. Why did they not include a mask for underneath of that grill? Sweet Dita's trail maintenance. They really should have included a mask for that. That's on them. Use the clips to connect it to the to a GST cable and connect that to the battery. I'm yeah. an a-hole for a living. That's my wife, she'll be glad to tell you. <laughs> hmm. Can I... So I do need to take the overspray film off before putting stickers on. T top tip for you all. Oh my gosh, Jessica Stewart says, a bra on the window keeps the lizards away because her husband's a truck driver. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Yes, it was on Thing of Earth. I had a package of cuties oranges on my counter the other day. That was the color of the body. So that is mold orange colored body. <laughs> <laughs> Mets our season. Hello, everyone. Does the ripper two come with a decoder ring? You painted it with the that on? That goes on the outside to keep overspray. Oh, okay. See, I know what I'm doing. Do you? I'm a professional. Okay. Let's see. That's not dry. That's dry. Don't <laughs> drag your, did you drag your fingernail through it no. to ruin it? Sure didn't. Did I say yes? I believe it was Thingiverse. Yes. What are you doing now? What are you looking I was at? just looking to see if I had anything to class up the, ooh. I thought be the shortest build ever. It is. Um, it is a pro fresh and all ish. Let's see. You know what's up? Oh yeah. Who just? Who just did what? Did that? Yeah. Well, that was a lot. Screw it. I'm just going to put a little of this on there. If I turn the quality down to 140p, that paint job looks awesome. <laughs> oh, it smells. Hey, Nicole, 
have Josh show you the video I sent him. I watched it about five times. So funny. So true. It says Rob Montana. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, apparently it was good. Black Sharpie. It's just too much area. <laughs> friction tape behind the grill. I just don't have, I was going to just do electrical tape or something like that. I just don't have any electrical tape or this is carbon fiber. Is it real carbon fiber? Of course. Double-sided carbon fiber is the new thing. Does Josh question Nicole when she's using her appliances? Uh, no. Do I? You guys work great together. Thank you, Derek. Is the Ripper 2 based on the VS410? <laughs> God. Not gonna lie, I thought that body was gonna look like the flex, flex seal truck, but it doesn't look too terrible. Ripper, Ripper, Ripper 2. I mean, yep. Yeah. So, I just put that on there so that when the grill goes on, it's not. Will there be a flex right seal group. option for the ripper axle? See. They see. It's very important. We're all about the details now. Ripper two will be based on the SCX ten seven. Yes. <laughs> exactly. That's what we're waiting on. Okay. Let's throw the screws in here. What are you doing, Suck? I'm sorry, is my drawer bothering you? Yeah. Okay, now we need some light buckets. What are you nitpicking? Somebody asked me if it was a Monet. It's all one color. Isn't Monet the guy who's speckled? It looks, it looks good from afar. Is that what it is? Oh, when you get it. Okay. I meant speckle, like large. You know what I meant. The Ripper 2 will be unveiled at Viterra Fest. <laughs> The uh, Ripper 2 will be to my CC01 based. Ah. UTR explores a win win brushing up on your top heavy driving skills and full play techniques all in one. And what techniques? Four play techniques. I know that. You need me to look that definition up. <laughs> Inappropriate. This is a kid's show. I don't even know you. <laughs> You're going to go in 10 minutes less, 120 kilometers to home. There we go. Ripper 2 will be an STL file for the people's home aluminum printers. <laughs> jo has Josh ever seen Clueless? Oh, he has. Oh, I've had. That was my childhood time frame. There we go. Jackson Pollock. There you go. Who will start the Ripper 2 petition? Signs need to be made. Let's organize. <laughs> That looks like an Origin 18. I know. It's definitely a bit of a VS4 knockoff. Next, Flex Seal. What's the next worst goop for an RC to be covered in? Goop. Um, oh, man. That's a, that's a good question. What would... I mean, JB Weld? JB Weld has a strong possibility of being worse than Flex Seal. The only thing that YouTube Man. would allow is for the kids is the cats. <laughs> <laughs> the Ripper 2 is being factory assembled in artist seat while, as we speak. <laughs> There's a severe shortage Marine of labor there. Nah, that's easy. You can get that brush and washed off quick. <sighs> Rhino liner hot glue. Hot glue would be in the tar. Shoe glue, shoe goo. He showed us his foreplay on Wednesday. Oh, really? What? I guess I need to go back and watch him. The to get the body off of that car, you basically just kind of. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Clear.
lipless. Yes. Okay, I get it. There's a there's. <laughs> you just... So I I <laughs> I need to dress up as a Bronco body apparently. What time are you guys? It's 4 a.m. here, a loving life. It is 8 15 p.m. <laughs> Get in the goddamn hole. Where'd it go? The one time my wife looked over, she saw Josh's version of four. <laughs> <laughs> the Come here. Yeah. Come uh, here. Oh my God. <laughs> Isaac Jarrett gave us four dollars or five dollars and said four play. That's it. <laughs> Shit. I just realized something else. We're we're both um red. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Can't yeah, take that back part because I missed the lens. It's a separate lens. <laughs> what, baby? Come here. Yeah. Oh, there's a little one too sleeping. He's in the one clear spot on the floor. Shh, that's it's perfectly clear. The one clear spot on the floor. He's sleeping in the middle. And like he's like There may be a number of RC cars parked on the floor in this room. Oh, parked? Stored. Stored. Is that how that works? They're in a line. There's an order. I don't think I'm people kinda... like humans can punt RC cars out the front door. Because that's what's about to happen. Oh, did we talk about guns being drawn today? Oh, yeah. I was trying to go to work today, and there was a parade of cars behind my jeep driving by which is not normal for our street and then uh as i tried to leave there was police officers like a little way a little ways down the road um that were had their guns drawn and at a house and we do not live in a neighborhood where that would be a common sight um i did get on next door obviously obviously um to see what was going on after he texted me that and um they apparently the p it was the rent the house that's for rent and apparently the people had said um on next door said sorry if we did anything to piss off our neighbors <laughs> so i don't know they get like someone call in something on for like seven cop cars to be there I damn mean. but then someone also said that like that many showed up at a baby shower they had one time here. Yeah. So. It is an area that like, mm -hmm. if something happens. Are you by what? No, that's. No, no, no. Like, like we're, we're not. That's why people, I think that's why the police show up. Because like if something happens in this area, they're like, we'll be right there. These. Hi. I'm just going to try and jam Look it. on Facebook Vanquish fan page or for two announce. God. Where, where are you going? I will happily delete that thread. Oh. Meow. Police raiding the producer of flying cars. I wish. Okay. We are going to try and just. Um. Oh, no. Did you. Um. say how you got an email today oh no i got an email today from the fine folks at camtech where i got my reliant robin reliant regal specifically because another friend of mine had or was trying to order one and his credit card wouldn't was like detecting fraud from being in the uk an order coming from the uk so he uh he had to email them to be like hey can you send me an invoice and they're like, sure. Um, can you tell us where you saw this? Because we're getting a lot of these from the U.S. right now. And we're trying to. <laughs> we think maybe a YouTube, someone on YouTube is like 
promoting it. We really want to say thanks. <laughs> So. I'm like, that's my husband, Lubin Markets. Yeah. Three-wheel RC car. Lubin Markets right here. <laughs> Don't buy Doja coin. <laughs> buy three-wheel RCs. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's see if this works a little um, smoother. Since you guys like small exotic pets while you're in town, I can take you to the Wallaby Farm. Oh, my God. There is a sloth farm in Oregon, where you, or it's not a farm, it's like a sloth rescue, and you can s camp there, like you can sleep there the night, and the sloths like crawl around your tent. Which and sounds I'm like the amazing. creepiest thing amazing. ever. Amazing. Like, uh, yeah, I just... A, a what? Non-fungible token? You need to make some NFTs. Yeah, it, they're weird. It's a, it's a weird, it's like a, you basically, it's like you can sell a photo, but it's a not, it's NFT is a not yet non-fungible token, which means like, it's the rights to it in a, it's very odd. I know what they are and I've, I've researched like why they are a thing, but I still don't necessarily truly understand the whole thing. Sacramento sheriffs tend to all show up at once. Had 17 cars and the helicopter after one homeless guy at Orangeville Park a while back. No disc golf for me that day. <laughs> it's probably that one I used to pass all the time. That disc. Uh oh. What? What? You little shithead. Nope. Down. Maybe they should send some boat motors instead. Down. Yeah, I did call him an, an influencer. Come on. Come on. The 24 Hours of Lemons with Reliant Three Wheelers has created the demand. Yes, that's what we're talking about. Sorry, I over-nerded when you called out Doja. <laughs> I went to the Cam Tech website, just didn't pull the trigger. <laughs> Josh is the reason I have a dancing rider. Worth it. So much fun. It's not even the rights. It's the rights to experience of viewing the photo. Yeah, it's very odd. But there can only be one for a photo. Do an engineer drawing of a potential Ripper 2 design make an NFT equals profit? No. Oh. Hi. This grill is much harder to put together than the real VS410. It's not a real VS410. I know, it's a knockoff version. What's preferred? Dancing or dual rider? Uh, that's just body style. I do like that the dual rider comes with black plastics. I think that's a nice touch. Derek from Ireland said, my day's already off to a great day. Thanks, guys. Thanks for joining. Matt's here. He says, this is still on. Yes, Matt. The body is painted even. Where's your matte light? Oh, it's still up there. It is. The matte signal is up there. I needed to upgrade it to a brighter signal. Okay. Where's that other lens shit will ripper two owners be required to get an r2 tattoo on their palms so they can secretly high five the other owners and heckle the peasants nope we're gonna microchip you you have to you have to agree to be microchipped we're gonna track you that's how the only way we'll ever do are it you, what are you are you are you bill gates am i bill gates <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's how. <laughs> you must agree to sign up to be microchipped. Built on the SCX 107. Microchip you. In association with Microsoft. <laughs> you really have to build some nice shelves to display your car on that purple wall. Each five each Ripper two comes with a five G. <laughs> Did you also hear that Traxxas also came out with an updated lighting system and a remote controlled winch? Now, I did. That's something you can put on your scale news update. Yep, I got it. I don't. I don't have it. I, I have it written. It says, okay, where's the line? Sign me up. <laughs> I would just constantly send software updates to your arm. Like, I feel like I'm itchy today.
That'd be ooh, a way to get alerts to you guys every live stream. Like it's when oh, it's Wednesday, six o'clock. Okay, gotta go. Why is Josh building half a truck? It's so tiny. The chips in the D bag. Your sunglasses are over there, by the way. Because I know you're going to ask for me tomorrow. I always know where they're at. No. I do. Will we all learn the Khmer with software for Ripper 2? <laughs> <laughs> Controlled. Can you just chime in on the microchip my wife has me on? <laughs> uh, Nick has the same Uline mug. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you too. You too can spend $2,500 and get yourself a Yeti. You have the best like gifts, though. Yeah, like gifts. Like that Chiefs jacket. Oh, yeah, that was nice. Yeah. Basically, all the packaging girls now at work have Uline mugs and... Yeah. So far, no one minds having to be microchipped on Facebook. Boy, are you getting going to be pissed when you read this post. I will go delete it and then block whoever made Nick it. Brian Sherwood. <laughs> Done. Still doing it. Uh, Nick got it only for spending 500 What? Did you get the two pack? I think it was twenty five hundred bucks. This is the big. This is the big. The big one. The tumbler, not the coffee cup. You're getting screwed. <laughs> I said, "Oops, blocked." <laughs> you can't delete other people's. I can. Facebooks. On our groups. Yeah. I'm doing it. Because I'll get legitimate emails about that, <laughs> and I'll <laughs> I'll lose it. As long as my microchip doesn't tell my wife I'm at the hobby shop, <laughs> it'll just remind you while you're at the hobby shop. Do you need an outboard motor? You love boats. I don't know why you're so mad. You mad, bro? I like real boats. I don't know that that was necessary. Boats and hoes. I'm on a boat. <laughs> Why yeah, not? our cat's going to be microchipped. Um, we got the coffee cup for having to pick up our own shrink wrap. Sookie's getting too fat to fit through there. Where is she? Oh, she's not fat. She's just... Thick. Thick AF. Josh is not allowed in my Facebook group. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is the first one of these we've ever painted on a Friday night. Does she like motorboat? I. <laughs> Whoa. You're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone said something about the Raiders. Sucky. Josh, can you get a decal made for the flex? So by it says, I'm a real boat. <laughs> it's not I'm a real boat. No, I like real boats. That you can water ski behind. Like a, a sticker of Pinocchio saying I'm a real boat. <sighs> I'm a real boat. Uh, someone got the Yeti cooler when they ordered shrink wrap. God damn. Yeah. That's a lot of shrink wrap. The kitty is husky. Don't be a dick, Josh. <laughs> Scott says, I forget what I ordered to get the big cups. Is that the big cup? It is a big cup. Oh, look at you. Come on. Brian has Son of three a boats. Bitch. Brian has boats? Yeah. 
BT says, love you guys. Love you too. Thank you, BT. Damn, he... Man, these little body details suck. Suki is S-O-O-K-I-E. Did you get a new tire yet? I have not. He did fill it up for me the last night, though. Cheap likes the goat. I'm about to get a Yeti cooler from a guy who ordered a bunch of shrink wrap. <laughs> Funny thing is, is we had an we have an ex employee who <laughs> we had found was stealing all the Uline stuff, and we think that he was like padding Uline orders so that he could get more free folding chairs. Like, like we saw the list and we're like, wait, where? Why did we? Like. Do we have 30 folding chairs around here somehow? In some instances, Josh is a bad influencer on the wallet. Yeah, no shit. Josh, okay, have Matt send you the 110 figure of himself and make him stand on some skis. Then fishing line in the back of the toy boat up. Boom, real water skiing. God damn it. I mean, Sookie likes water. Stop. Cat videos make the money, babe. Does the Ripper 2 only have rear portals? You should have gotten out the iFixit kit for those screws. You I know. You use a real screwdriver. Exactly. And I've got, like, these little ones, but... Wait, Matt has a one-tenth figure of himself? Who did that? Somebody, like, 3D scanned him, and then... Like, his whole body? Yeah. How'd that happen? It's a thing. You can do it. I'm not doing it. No. Why would you ever want that? I know. I don't want that. I know. Sounds like the worst, right? Yeah. Like Actually, Matt has one that's just his head, even, that he put on a different one. It's creepy. I know. I'm still friends with him, but... You you get head one of you in a heart. No. Yes, you would. You know how big that would be? I know, but you get that. I would not. You would. I would not. But like the whole body thing, I don't want to see that. Ugh. Of me or? Of me. Oh. I don't want that. No, thank you. No. Brian Schroeder has a 1932 Thompson. I don't know uh, what a Thompson is, but it sounds wooden. That would be off. Yeah. I just upgraded my Pro Boat Stealth Wake 23 to brushless with Traxxas Vil... VXL. Vil... Valinian. Valinian Electronics in it. Don't know if it's going to be worth it unless there's a cheaper combo upgrade you had in mind. I, I really don't know anything about boats. Yeah. I'm about to. Um, I sold some of my Doja to buy a BS4 Pro 10 the other day. <laughs> nice. I got the zero gravity love seat from our Uline orders. What? <laughs> zero gravity love seat? My chair out back is a zero gravity. Yeah, but is that a brand or that's just like a style? It's a style. It like feels like zero gravity. Right. Kind of, but not a lot. Lay in and watch UFOs here. <laughs> there was one night. There was one night that we did see some very weird things. Weird but things. I'm not saying it was a UFO. I'm not saying it wasn't. But we're not, I'm not saying it was. But I'm not saying it wasn't. Get in your hole. <laughs> I just got an email from Vanquish. I guess Ripper 2 is a thing. No. Nope. nope. What if your character was too fat for one ten scale? Thank you. Exactly. Um, is there a reason why some SNU info comes after your show so that by the time you talk about it, it's old news? Is there a reason that like the company wants to like like we'll just wait till Tuesday to put this out so he can't talk shit about it this week? <laughs> <laughs> Alex, that's your job. What? Okay. Oh, Swap my used Capra for a 
Near new Traxxas M41 boat. Good or bad deal? No idea what that means. Yeah, even. I did see. There was some... Son of a bitch. That was supposed to go on before. Uh, it will be at the 1000 Islands Antique Regatta in Clayton, New York on August 11th through 13th. Yes, Josh Cedar Strip Boat. That sounds amazing. Jay Concept should take the hint. <laughs> 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 yeah if you don't know then what is it by definition it's a ufo well in that regard yes yeah just remember josh a good boat floats pro tip <laughs> <laughs> Is this still happening? You said this was going to be the shortest ever. It is. when If you consider the entire process, some of these take months. Oh, my God. This one, mere hours. Body trim details. Spicy. There's so many more stickers on that thing. Do you know how fast stickers go? Uh, I'm watching. I'm just pretty sure J-Concepts is just fucking with Josh at this point. <laughs> J-Concepts is actually secretly owned by a really rich person who just gets has a really weird sense of human, humor. And he's just like, all right, do this next. Watch watch this asshole. Watch, uh, watch this guy make his silly high school news show in his spare bedroom of his house. Yeah. <laughs> it's not even a bedroom. I know. It's a den. It's a den. There's not even a closet. There's not. It's tiny. <laughs> it is tiny. Uh, RC Patina Guy says, so my wife wants a drag race. What no prep car would you suggest? Yeah. Uh, I'd get the DR10. Seems like it's got the best support. That sticker's crooked AF. Hopefully Sue won't Fine. send you pics of me Fine. in period boating clothes. No. What kind of hat does he wear? What kind is it? Is it leather? Is it leather? A captain's hat. Meanwhile, see, really, Josh gets a kickback every time he says Jay Concept. Man, I wish. Yeah. <laughs> he is on their do not fly list. <laughs> Pretty sure. <laughs> Pretty sure alarms go off whenever he gets close. Do you know Jason? Jason Rona? Yeah. No, he's the actual owner of Jay Concepts. Ah. Uh -huh. He's probably a very nice human. He is. I've met him before. Oh. I just don't know him. No, him, no. But he's a very nice human. Yes. You're just a dick. They just make ugly bodies. Some of them. Not all of them. RC Underdog. Good night. 124th VS410. I know. Oh, VS2410. VS2410. Right. Sorry. In... Why did the bicycle fall over? Because it was too tired. Hey. That you have terrible opinion. Me? So, yeah. I'm going to show you some bodies, and you're going to guess which ones are J Concepts and which ones aren't. How about that? I bet it's not that bad. I'm. How about we play this little game? Josh is like, I need a scout. How, do you, do you, would you like I to play? need it to look like a scout. Otherwise, I don't like it. <laughs> Working my and on my enduro gatekeeper cage right now. First time cutting out panels and painting. It isn't perfect, but I'm happy how it looks so far. You and Matt guy inspire me. Nice. Yes, the pa the panel thing can be a little weird with flat panels, but white skipper hat with collarless striped shirt, and we won't talk about the pants. <laughs> <laughs> would you get the kit or the rtr dr10 Ooh, uh rtr probably just because of how easy it is to get in and then you can decide from there like if you wanted how much further you want to go set it up as a 13.5 car and go have fun before like going crazy on a bunch of other stuff put a body on it that you like obviously you're going to paint one up for her, um and just have a blast 
I'm waiting for the J Concepts Geo Tracker. I do love a Geo Tracker. You though. do, I know. Uh, you know, Perline made one. Uh, you know that Lloyd is Jason's late late uncle, right? Nope. I've asked a million times, what is a Lloyd? Nobody has ever said. Everyone, uh, Geo Tracker would actually be cool. Proline made one for a little while. I'm the, expecting a J Concept Yaris just because called of the how Descender. Much we talk about the Yaris. <laughs> Carolina Ghost gave us five dollars. J Concept bodies never look right. The new SCX ten twenty or fuck, SCX twenty four bodies are just awful. John, Nicole, don't mess with Josh. He has a degree, you know. No. Aztec body next, says Phoenix. <laughs> that would be rad. I love terrible vehicles. I just like when they look right. <laughs> they do. look like terrible. Look like the correct terrible vehicle. True North RC said they do look poo poo. <laughs> 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 uh what do you think of banggood rc products worth it or sometimes or just avoid it uh i mean as far as the rc part i mean if you're buying it as like a jokey throwaway thing it's why you know, would you buy it if it's a jokey throwaway because some of them are like 50 bucks and if that's what you're looking for is like 50 dollars worth of fun then maybe you're all right but don't expect to find like good repair parts or things like that so as far as like hobby grade stuff I would pass for the most part. Uh, Except right. some of the small, the like small scale stuff, like the RGTs, those seem to be pretty well supported. Um, but if you're going to go in like the larger 10 scale stuff, I'd go with a brand you can find support for, whoever it may be. Toyota Echo Dragon. <laughs> Literally, I, I know we've had this conversation before that I think that the Echo was the ugliest car ever made. Really? Yeah. I mean, it was probably one. I. I watched a video today, a video review on the 1992 Geo, uh, what was the little car? The Geo, was it the Prism or Storm? Not not the Prism. It was the one that you could, it was the two-door, but it came in a convertible. Doug DiMero just did a review on it. It was hilarious. 50 horsepower. You don't even need a driver's license for that. No, that's 50 cc. <laughs> What was your first car? A Mercury Capri. A Capri. Which probably had 50 horsepower. It's about the same thing. Yeah. yeah. It would have been the same. A Metro. Metro. That, thank you. I love a Volkswagen thing. Those are awesome. Those are the worst. Those are so cool. Ugh. Those were so cool. It said nobody ever. I think... Uh, the Bigfoot just said things are awesome. I think they're so cool. Whenever I see one, I'm like, yes, you got that. BT gave us $5. Thank you, sir. Wishing Thank everyone BT. a pleasant evening. You as well. Have a good weekend. Is the Hobbywing Fusion faster or slower on a two-speed TRX? Uh, I don't understand the question. Uh, on two-speed TRX, then what? My stock CJ2A made 80 horsepower in 1946. <laughs> Carolina Ghost gave us $2. Thank you. SCX 10 3 Yaris Off Road Edition. So there was a video that I got sent like 30 times today <laughs> of a off road Reliant Robin from TikTok. So, momentum. It was two wheel drive, obviously. I'm just trimming these stickers to fit a little better. Has nothing to do with that. I, maybe I set it on there a little too far forward, but it looks fantastic, right? I'm still thinking about an off road. Yeah. I will. I will find the video for you. Um, how fast is the second gear in the Hobbywing Fusion on TRX4 Defender? Oh, I, I mean, I couldn't tell you the actual speed. I, 
I, I don't know that. I'm sorry. Miata off-road spin all over too. Oh, yeah. We have an off-road Miata that lives around us. Well, off-road, it's safari you know? No, I don't know. It's like where they put big tires and stuff like that on it. He drives through here all the time. I no. pass him. What, does this thing not have body clips? It's clipless. <laughs> a Volkswagen Type 3, it was a wagon? I don't know what that is, but it sounds amazing. Yeah? I don't have body clips that small. Oh, actually, will you see if that bin is right down there with my body clips? Does it say body clips? No, it's a white bin. Um, oh, it, it's, sorry, it's a clear bin. Very bottom shelf, left side. Oh, fucking Eddie. I don't know why he gave me those. Because sometimes you need body clips. He's like, well, Josh ever use these? I was like, no. He's like, take them anyway. I think they're too big. Yeah, way too I big. I drove a Reliant Robin on the road once. It was my worst driving experience. Yeah. I thought the answer was LS Swap. <laughs> I don't even know what that was too. It was something Alex said, but. Well, we don't have body clips unless they're under something. No, nope, that's the charger. You know that thing came with body clips. Like, you know it did. It could have been lost. Your stupid ass lost them. You think Sookie ate them? No, I think you lost them. I think that that's true. Spare parts? No, that's from my kit. Is there any situation Josh would take looks over performance on a toy truck? No. That's not true. I'm sure there is. No, it didn't come with them. You're a liar. I'm positive. I dumped out those bags before and I would see four body clips. Mm -hmm. No, you definitely lost. I think. I'm telling you. MV Nichols says, hey guys, love your show. That's an awesome cat. Beautiful. And he has huge set of nuts. So when they're facing <laughs> the camera. They're, they're big in person too. I'm not going to lie. Like every once in a while, I'm like, just like, Jesus cat. Yeah. I mean, we've never had one. I mean, they're all. Yeah. No, this didn't come with body clips. Oh, you. I'm Here, I came with zip ties. Is it zip ties? Yeah. That may have been their solution. C channel versus flat rail chassis. I feel Josh would say C channel. That is true. Boss info. I didn't lose that. Definitely lost them. Did you put them somewhere? Yeah. This horse shit. All right, well. Can't ever finish anything, can you? Oh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> we got close, though. You literally cannot finish anything. <laughs> You're the worst. Son of a bitch. You want some bobby pins? Those are way too big. Okay. I'll put, I'm going to put some... Uh, <sighs> I'm just going to trim a little off the back of this body. Make it fit the bumper a little easier. Well, that new parts tray worked out well. Telling you, <laughs> they weren't in there. Why Why are you doing that? Because uh, this that thing comes down oh, around the gosh, side. I'm just trying to get it, trim it up a little bit. These are my new body scissors. They're super freaking long. From ProTech. That's what plants crave. <laughs> let's, let's go up just a hair more. My partner just asked if I'm watching Harley, Josh, and Nicole and delivered me a plate of pizza. Well, they're amazing. Yeah. They'll show up in the robot tomorrow. <laughs> Bailing wire and patience, man. Why do you sell this plugged in? I feel like that's a fire hazard. Nah. You're never going to drive this thing. 
Perhaps if the Vanquish tray were magnetic. No. I do not like magnetic trays. Why? Because most of the stuff we use is stainless. The only thing it ever seems to actually hold is like metal shavings. <laughs> like, I do. If that was like an option, we're like, maybe we should do a magnetic tray. Like, no. Stop us saying ever. Obviously, so over. So many opinions. So many opinions. Yes, do you need a, a box of safety pins? Okay. And you could cut off. Well, I do have. I have another one of these. I'll just take two out of that. <laughs> Cause you're never gonna drive any of them? What is that thing anyway? What is what thing? The harvest truck. It's a harvester. This is the Rushmore. Oh, it's literally the same thing? Yeah. Huh. Is it an international? Well, this is a harvest. You said it's this a is harvester. A, this is, is a Rushmore. International? No, it's just a knockoff name. Oh, gotcha. Body yeah. pins are with the missing tail light. Now I'll ask him if I have the missing tail lights. Didn't want to put <laughs> the top shelf rig since he painted it. Those are carb pin clips. Carb pin, carbon. <sighs> There's the tail light. I still need to put it in, but I was going to give Nicole a reprieve since it's nine o'clock almost. It is. You're right. It is a bad knockoff of Willie's. Oh, then... yeah, it's a friend. <laughs> For comparison, that's an SCX 24. Oh, so that's the 18th scale. What? Say, it's kind of scale. because basically normally for 18th scale it would get like a little wide like basically it's the same width as an scx 24. Uh, you're such so i'm just saying like normally you would think it would be bigger all over really it's just the wheelbase it's just like a little bit longer and it's a full width body but you get it yes it is for sure 18th scale in the past used to be bigger though like what people called 18th scale well isn't it just what scale it is yeah, but like one tenth scale is kind of so. Well, I feel like it should just be one tenth. Yeah, they're closer to one ninth or one eight point five. I would like to know that. Well, I'd love. You want me to tell you how to do the math? I would be. I would uh, happy no, to explain it. No, I just that. want to know. I just want it to be an SCX or VS for nine point. Three one Scout eight hundred. Stop. What? Just to shoot. You're an idiot. Wheelbase. It was one hundred inches. What? Eighty eight hundred both one hundred inches. Interesting. Um, don't you think? So this one is sh somebody. Oh, somehow things are just still falling over. Even oh, though she's right there. I don't know. What you're so, I don't stop. I'm stop. Let's stop. Nobody wants to see this. Nobody wants to see this. Hit the six hit, and a quarter. Hit the end button and do that. The, 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 hit the end button and do that. Uh, Nobody wants that. Nobody wants six to see that. and an eight. It's quick math. There's no such thing. Uh, one hundred divided by six point oh one two five. You're such a loser. Actually, it's sixteen point three scale. What that one is? Yeah. So it's bigger than 18. It's scale. even bigger than 18 scale. Or what do you need to know? What do you know? How many squares is that? <laughs> that I do know. <laughs> yeah. Because Matt is like me. Like, it's five squares. We really don't need the rest of these. Stickers, door handles and shit. Nah, never gonna use that anyway. I don't know what little foil stuff is. That was probably what was supposed to go behind the grill. My. If you build a rig you won't drive to match the rig you didn't drive. <laughs> Where's your TI 82? TI 82? If it's not a TI 89, I, I don't want it. Now, what's the track width scale? DLC is just being a hater tonight. 
Let's see. We're at four and a quarter. Scout eight hundred. And potty pins are on the sticker sheet. Um, sir. <laughs> let's see. Width five feet eight inches. So that's what five feet is sixty plus so sixty eight. The goat has zero ears. Sixty eight divided. What did I say? The goat has lost both its ears. Both of them. Yeah, he took one off, and then I don't know what the other one just came off. I think I stepped on it. Four and a half. Four and a half. Fifteen point one scale. Hmm. So she's a little wider. Oh no, what? Alex is freaking jumping in on the calculator thing. Somebody said eighty two. He said TI eighty four is where it's at. Eighty nine was overcomplicated. Eighty nine was not overcomplicated. It was need. You needed the equation solver. The there's so many things it did. It did so well. And honestly, solving equations, multiple variables, was the key. Does anybody else watch Clarice? Which one is that one? That's the... Let me let me get that X-Acto knife. Let's not play with that one. Yeah. So. Seriously, dude. <laughs> you can't have it. He took off with it. I know. He took off with the TV remote today off the couch. Yeah. 100 millimeter tire size is 1.9 inch tire size, right? Looking at the Hummer H1. 100 millimeter is four inches tall. That is not a 1.9. I have the 85 quad graphics. I prefer Casio. It looks catty wonky. Mm. That's because the body pins aren't on everywhere. Um, How do you slope? <laughs> the, uh, no. The 80, what, what, what? I fell. Oh, you were falling? <laughs> I was like, what is going on? <laughs> How? How did you just fall? I just was kept spinning. Usually you're closer to me. <laughs> oh, I see. Partially because of that? Partially. The 89 used a terrible language and was personally difficult. Like, no. It the didn't matter if it's an 85 or an 89 as long as you can spell boobs backwards. In on an eighty nine, you could type actual notes. I five. Um, he is a Cheeto, a Cheeto cat. Yeah, half Bengal and half Asa cat. There you go, good boy. And get that goat. You get that goat. Yes, the 89 was brilliant for inter for engineering students. We could type in so much information so you could take it into class and have all of the notes. Because you could type it on a computer and import it into your calculator. Oh, so nice. You could have pages of notes. It hurt, didn't it? Yeah, it really did. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no joke. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> it really hurt. I got you. <laughs> Uh, I had a bruise from you pinching me with your feet. I'm good at that. On my arm. Yep. True story. I regret nothing. Somebody, Perry says two of his clients have no ears left. They must have just been shitty ears. Because it, yeah. Um, hello from Colorado, Shadow Systems RC. You can type notes on an 84 and it has a basic compiler. It's got to be the good. The 89 was the key. Every, it had so much. So. Can not just write notes on paper? No, because. I will. You couldn't necessarily take paper notes in. So if it was in your calculator, though, it they looked like you were just. That shit. No. It just looked like you were doing well, stuff on your calculator. Dumb. DDI time. And so. You yeah, could have all that stuff. In answers on a small paper and replace a quick sheet that was on the cover. Okay, that's. The only thing I ever used my calculator for was you could. No, we had to have, we would have, you'd have Stop. chapters Stop. and page and like Stop. so much information. I do remember that. Stop. No, before, no. before they caught on to what a, like a Palm Pilot was. 
I had a HP iPack, which was basically a little window. It had Windows Mobile on it, and you could run Excel on it. And I was in my intro to highway design class. And we had to, in there for one of our tests, we had to calculate and plot the curves along, or the points along a curve for a road. Literally. And I wrote a spreadsheet to do it. 65 people have logged off. I went into the test, punched the numbers in, and it'd give me all of them and write them all down. I was done in that test in like 15 minutes. You didn't have to show your work? 100%. What? You didn't have to show your work? No. I'm telling you. And this man designed roads. Yeah, with computers where you didn't have to do it all by hand because it did it. I knew how to use my resources, which is an engineering milestone. That's what you need to do. Use your resources. Oh, he's pulling wires out of whatever box that is. We should be done. Thank you all. You've been great. Yes. We got a truck painted and drove it. Whole thing. Ish. I'm drinking so much coffee that I should start building my Prusa. What is that? That 3D printer that's out there. Oh, good night. Oh, you, you want to hang around? Part two? Live stream number two? <laughs> Prusa edition? Go for it. Knock yourself out. <laughs> so, all right, guys. We'll see you Sunday morning at 10 a.m. And yeah, that's all. Because they don't see enough of you. Not everybody. Some people might watch this on replay and they want to see me live. Doubt it. Probably. I agree. Later. Bye.